Let me know if you can see and hear shit. I gotta type that on Twitter. Ah, oh, thought. Okay. Give me just a moment. This is this is uh my way of entertaining you I get everything set up. I love Nevada, One Troll, Game Boy, T Dog Rat, Herlock, Dice, Swift, Beaver, Cafe Latte, Shovey, Tentacle Rat, Incromancer, Bada Bing, Trash, Deer Boy, Taco Bomb, CY, Duel, Lunarian, Cidic, <laughs> Subnautic, yeah, pretty much. Hello Jezel, Bloodberry, Symphony, Chibi Corn, and Valid Mech, Kazatov, Mad Mank, Mitru One. Ninja, that is the red frame Gundam Mistray. Okay. Give me a second. Webcam audio getting out. I'll disable it in a second. Give me a moment. As soon as I unplug the webcam, it should go back to normal. I just have to do my tweet and start the game up. Okay. David reminded if you hear anything besides Lowell, you are gang stalking me in an attempt to force me to doubt my sanity. Twitch.tv slash Tolomeo. Okay, we got a nice good old clickbait title. One of my personal favorites. Hello, Wolf Dude. Magic Man, Wen Rindin, Third World Weed, Neko Chandney, Pyro Man, Motion Lord, Radica, Better Than Him. Okay, so now I just need my alert widget and then I'll start Hollow Knight and unplug the webcam and it should go back to the good audio. I, I need to fix that before tomorrow. It's kind of a pain in the ass that it's still doing it. Hmm. Alright. The audio should sound better now. Ow, fuck. Okay. I, I have a, uh... I had a nightmare last night. It was a really, it was a really bad nightmare. What's good to see if I could, Kaiser K. And Candia, Phoenix Fire. A little quiet. I mean, it's, the volume is at maximum, so... Let me turn Hollow Knight down. I think it's it's less uh, less me being quiet and more the game being loud. Hello, buddy. You don't sound like you're underwater anymore. I, when I have the webcam plugged up, even though the microphone part of it is disabled, it uses the microphone part of the webcam. Why you would ever use a why, why a hardware designer would ever put a microphone in a webcam? I have no fucking clue. But yeah, hello, pineapple punch, quack. Husky, Crimson Fucker, thank you for the six month resub lavender size. I appreciate it. Thank you very much. Um, so, I had a bad fucking dream last night. What's going on, say Michael Empty Perspective? And I actually hear nothing right now. Be back later, I, right, Kazatov. What the fuck? That was weird. Okay, so, essentially, what happened was. I woke up, no, not woke up, uh, in, in, in the nightmare, I woke up in just excruciating fucking pain. I felt my le like my leg was on fire and that shit was gonna fall off. And I, I felt like screaming in the dream. I'm like, oh shit, dude, what the fuck? And it was the weirdest dream I've ever had. Uh, I've never had a, a dream quite like that. And then I woke up and my leg hurt like hell and I realized it wasn't a fucking dream. I managed to completely fuck my leg while I was asleep. How? I don't know, but I can barely fucking walk today, dude. Like, I pulled a muscle, gave myself like a Charlie horse, God knows what in my sleep. I've gotta be the only motherfucker on the goddamn planet that can injure himself on that level when he's fucking asleep. Uh, so that's, that's how my day's been. My leg fucking hurts. A lot. Okay. Hello, communism for dummies, Bridgewater, Rock and Ram. Pull the muscle while sleeping. I don't know what the fuck, like, what actually happened, but it hurts. What's gonna Mago? Mr. Not. Take too much? No. 
And for the people who were asking last night, we went to the Deep Nest and uh, beat the Mantis Lords. That's where we. That's what we last did. And we also found some weird shrub boss thing. Charlie Horse is hurt like hell. Yeah, I, I actually had to ask my sister, yo, did I like scream in the morning or last night? And apparently I, I resisted the urge to actually fucking yodel, but I woke up and it was just terrible pain. I, I don't know what the fuck I did, but I'm very impressed with myself. That lady fall on his leg and give him a hairline fracture? Well, that'd suck. I mean... You know what, never mind. I'm not, I'm not gonna say what was on my mind. Thank you for the one year resub, the Nacho Man. Oh yeah! I appreciate it, dog. Thank you very much for the one year. How are you? We had a five minute pre-stream at the fish tank. Um, tomorrow we'll be doing a Gundam stream, so there will be no video games tomorrow. It will be me fucking around, uh, building robots on camera for several hours. God, that hurt my throat. Holy shit. Hello, baby. What's good? Penguin. Stuffy Luffy. One leg. Oh, no, it's just one leg. It's it's my, uh, my right leg. Let's see Sif. Yeah, she'll, she'll pop in. I got a Charlie horse. That's weird. And it's not too bad it does hurt, but I don't mind muscle pain that much. Like, it hurts, but it's not, like, uh, excruciating, you know what I mean? Like, dental pain is excruciating. That, that shit I cannot stand. But muscle pain's not so bad. What's your Hubert? Not having a two-hour pre-stream? Sad, I'm sorry. Hello, I say MD. And thank you for the four-month resub, Munchie. I appreciate it, dog. That emote's fucking scary, though. You're gonna have to stop that. Whose emote is that? I don't know what a Gurchy is, but I, I hope that's not their actual face, because it's kind of it's kind of creepy, dude. <laughs> um, thank you for the bits, cry, bro. What's going on, Captain Crow? How the fuck's find about the Hachio Sushi? We have it at HEB here. We I've seen it in real life. Not not that level of sushi, but will this work? Can't blame the motherfuckers for trying, right? Not gonna be able to hit me here, asshole. I'm not gonna be able to hit you either, I suppose. What's good, Skull, Fedgle? <laughs> Alright. Hello, Guan in your ass. Zawful can go back to sleep. I'm surprised I fell back to sleep because it was really, really bad pain, like I'm saying. Oh, shit. Okay. I'm doing bad on Shaq. Give me a second. What's going on, honey bears? New viewer and lots of love. Really appreciate your love, hate for the community. Keep it straight. And best of luck in your next adventure. Well, thank you very much for the 5,000 bits, Miracle Worker. I appreciate it. But I... If, if, you, if you mean love, hate, like... Do you mean... I am I'm confused as to what you mean by that. Like the Hollow Knight community or, or what? Because I don't I, I, I can't really say I hate any community. Um I just like picking on communities. That's my thing. I'm I'm someone who just likes being a curmudgeonly old fuck. I'm I'm basically a dinosaur. I'm I'm twenty five years of age. I'm gonna be twenty six very soon. God of War streams, gotcha, yeah, yeah. Um No, I I, I appreciate the kind words. Thank you very much for the bits. But there's there's no hate. I just get frustrated sometimes. I'm easily I'm easily frustrated. I suppose. You old fucker. Yup. Too old. I'm out. I right, peace. Thank you for the sub. Lament. I appreciate it. Thank you very much. And enjoy the dog emotes and the rats. No, I'm just. I, I've been an ornery fuck lately, and I'm sorry. I'm just I, I'm getting old. You know. I I wake up and. I get mails on my doorstep about buying life alert and shit, but I don't I don't wanna fucking buy life alert. But I'm gonna have to soon. I'm I'm eating healthy now. You know what I had for fucking dinner today? I chopped up spinach, carrots, and mushrooms and made a fucking salad. That's what like no meme, I'm not even shitting you. 
the the T dog of last year would have hated the T dog of this year. Keep it going, alright, man. I I will do my best. There should be uh some good shit coming up soon. I'm I'm really enjoying Hollow Knight right now, so hopefully these are gonna be some good streams. I I am happy with how the one last night went. I just hope my mindless wandering doesn't put off too many people. Are you a rabbit? Nope. Okay, you say that sounds good. Ugh. Carrots are okay. Carrots are alright, but... Spinach and mushrooms? Oh my god. Oh man, hello giant poops. It was fucking terrible. Never before has a stream title spoken to me on a personal level. I'm scared. Oh, well, you know, that's what I'm here for, you know? Okay, so what I'm trying to do... I guess I need to... To be able to navigate through those spikes. So where else can I go? Maybe I should go all the way to the bottom. I know one of the exits on the right side due to the crystal area that I think I need a lantern for. Um, so let's go see what the second one does. Just stir fried that shit. Yeah, but that would have taken effort. Janny Soros told me to tell you hello. Oh, I like Janny. Janny's really nice. Tell them I said hi. Like that that channel has some interesting shit going on. Like some of the mods are are well. Some of the mods are, are quite domineering, let me put it that way. Then you have you have ones like Jenny who are really nice. Um so it's 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 a really it, it's a melting pot, to say the least. It's very strange. You gotta saute those mushrooms. I rescued two cats, one bailed into the woods. Chat advice on luring. Uh well if Monster Hunter's anything to go by, go outside and go and the cat should come running. Okay. Hello, Beepus, Grump Veteran. I don't think I can go this way either. I need something that'll let me break this. Alright. You salad dressings? No. Mushrooms were raw. Yeah, raw mushrooms, raw carrots, raw spinach. I don't, I don't cook that shit. Okay, audio's low. Give me a second. Let me see. It should not be low, but give me a moment. Game audio or me? I guess I should have should have asked. Twitter argument? Oh yeah, um I I got to say uh I'm not a fan Chesel. <laughs> that I I feel like that person is an active detriment. That that is like the the textbook example of someone you do not want in any sort of position of authority. What's going on, Bernie? You gotta cook those shrooms and cook carrots for top notch. Those two people need to turn it up. No, it's it's probably low game volume wise. Yes, the channel still with the lead of scum that are part of the all seeing corruption. True. Okay. Alright, so just just uh just in case you, you haven't fucking heard by this point in time. Also, what's good, Leo Wolfski? Wolf Sky, I'm I'm still not sure which one it is. Uh tomorrow will be the, the long awaited Gundam stream. So if that's something you're interested in, tomorrow night. I will be building two Gundam models, a small one and a medium-sized one. It'll be in an aquarium cam. I mean, the Sith will probably make a couple appearances, and it, it should be pretty fun. So, that that is tomorrow. At this time, probably around this time, yeah. I had Mango Habanero wings tonight. Are you proud of me? Yeah, Mango Habanero is pretty good. Okay, so I can't go this way. So I guess I'm going back to the Fungal Wastes. But actually, no, I need to go to the dirt mouth and buy the map that I missed for the Fungal Waste. Because that's my biggest problem with that area is I have no idea where the fuck I am. Because I don't have the map. I, I just bumbled my way to wherever the hell the Mantis Lords were and beat the shit out of them. That boss was fun. I hope they're more like that. I really like Mango Habanero Wings. I like spicy shit. Uh, the, the Mango Habanero from Buffalo Wild Wings, I... 
sometimes on Tuesdays I can go to my Buffalo Wild Wings and get 48 mango habanero wings for about $20. And shit's fucking amazing. If, if it wasn't like 20 minutes away, I would do it every, every single Tuesday. What's going on, B? Kill Triggerfish? That's the most heretical thing I've ever heard in my life, Blue Man. Okay. Speaking of which, uh, on the subject of fish, my, my vampire shrimp gets here tomorrow. Hopefully, this is my first time ordering shrimp or fish of any sort off of the internet. So hopefully they won't arrive dead. I am not particularly sure what to expect because the website I ordered them from is very, very highly rated. So, and they have a guarantee. So if it, get, if it does unfortunately get here and it's dead on arrival, they'll send me a new one, but I would hope, I hope that doesn't happen. It's Wolf Sky got you, okay. I'll do my best to remember that. Hello, Spectrum. That shrimp is huge. Yeah, yeah. And then I'm, I'm getting uh, three peacock gudgeons as well. I've never seen those fish in any sort of uh, aquarium or store, so I'm interested to see what those are like as well. They're apparently live bears, and I got three of them, so hopefully I get a breeding pair. You can't you can't get them sexed. You can't say, I want a male and a female. So you just gotta get a couple and hope for the best. So hopefully uh, I'll end up having fish babies. That'd be pretty dull. Shrimps look cool. Well, here's the thing. Apparently, they're they're pale until they get comfortable with their environment, and then they can change color to like red or blue. So hopefully, he'll be comfortable. Hello, Night Arc. I'm all right. How are you? Sanima. Sanima. He 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 wants to give me a sand anima, huh? I don't think I like this guy. be a safe space for the shrimp yeah i've got everything should be fine there's a current there's places for him to hide to latch onto to filter feed i'm even going to i even got like a little grinder thing so i can grind algae pellets into a particulate so he can he can get them <sighs> fuck is that title what do you mean what do you mean hello phil octave moose milk Uplink. Cherry flavor? I, I'm a degenerate who likes the taste of, of medicine. That probably makes me one of the biggest pieces of shit you've ever met. Hello, sport. Does it say hi to me? I'm sorry. It was a mistake. I was stalking some of your older VODs. I'm sorry. That's a fate worse than death. Okay. You don't love me? Well, I don't love... The, the only person I can, not, with all honesty, say that I love in this chat is uh, Amanda. That'd be kind of disingenuous if I were to say that I, I loved you, right? Because you, for all you know, I'm a frothing fucking psychopath in real life. Like, it, you have no idea if, if I am as presented on TV, you know? I could be like one of those McDonald's advertisements where you look at the billboard and oh man, that shit looks fucking dope. I want to eat that. Then you actually go to McDonald's and you order the burger and it looks like a fucking like a cow pat. It's like what the fuck? When they when they say cow patty, I didn't think it. I thought I didn't think it was that sort of patty. What the fuck? You know? You just never know on the internet. Like, I could listen to Nickelback unironically in real life. You realize that, right? Hello, Erloth and uh, Amater. Okay. Let's go down this way. Look at this photograph. Every time it makes me laugh. I've never gotten the disdain for Nickelback. Does that make me a reprehensible piece of fuck? 
Like, I don't like Nickelback, don't get me wrong, but I don't understand why they get picked on more than any other shitty, like, alternative rock band that was out at the time. Okay. I used to listen to Nickelback. The soundtrack's like Halo 3 ODST. I've never played that. What's good, Mask Guy? Just a meme to say you hate Nickelback. Oh, just like it's a meme to say you hate me, right? Hello, Kitch Tal. The only valid reason to hate Nickelback is the fact that the lead singer married Avril Lavigne at one point. I don't know if they're still together, but I mean, that's that's the only concrete, solid reason I can think of. That they, yeah, okay, that makes sense. I can understand that perspective. Lead singer is a person? Interesting. Sound fair? Well, most bands have, like, a, a distinct sound to to their shit, you know? I don't think there's something that's exclusive to Nickelback. It's copied by other bands later on. Lead singer was supposed to be a really chill dude. Was Isn't his name Chad, too? It's kind of funny now. It must it must be such an ego boost to have your name uh, be Chad in today's society. Hmm. Chad Kroger. God damn. This game sucks. Acid. That's fucked up. Look, you can fight Heffalumps from Winnie the Pooh in this game. Thank you for the three month re resub, Pit Panther eighty four. I appreciate it, and thank you for using that Prime sub on me again, homie. Three Nickelback songs that overlap? No, but I've seen the look at this graph thing and it makes me chuckle. Okay. We're gonna go to the bench first and five most. Uh, nope. Instead, we're gonna go for a swim. I love swimming. The link's allowed in chat as long as it's not porn, gore, a virus, or a link from JP. Yes. Something that you, as long as it's not something that's going to get me in trouble with Twitch, basically. Why no porn? Because Twitch will, will fucking ban me if I allow porn. What's this? I don't want that. Why is Tolo a vor boy? I don't know. People got tired of me making my title. I want to be stepped on by X. So, you know, I decided to improve it. There's nothing wrong with that. Haven't seen JP in a few days. Yeah. I'm not sure if JP is memeing or not. Like, I have... I have a distinct impression that he's... He, there's this... There's a type of person that frequents uh, that chat that I like to call the quadruple agent. Where it's like, oh, it's goddamn near impossible to tell if they actually like someone or whatever the fuck, if that makes sense. Ah, oh, fuck, okay. I wanted to check. Like, you can never really tell their true intentions, you know what I mean? So it's, it's just weird. I don't know what to make of them, to be perfectly blunt. Then again, I'm, I'm stupid, so I don't know what to make of most people. I'm not a very good judge of character a lot of the time. Wow! With the Nickelback Simulator? Wait, that's like, so you're not memeing? That's like a real thing? Wow. Filming yourself that you can't just I mean you you could I guess but No no bit Nevada Ristruby was like a lot of people don't really enjoy JP's shenanigans, but I don't think there's like genuine disdain for the most part was Ristruy. Literally nobody liked Ristruy. Not even me. And we, we, we fucking banned Ristory. Do you know how tall of an order it is to get banned here? 
Do you know what that's like? Like, what kind of individual you have to be? A land where Hank Hill Propane God has remained unmolested for years. Okay, that was not very smart of me. Don't ever call me honest again. That's the worst thing you can fucking say. I, uh, honest is such a little... Uh, fucking honest. Ninety percent. I mean, okay. Well, you know, here's the thing. You could make a straw poll, and I could say, "Hey, vote on this straw poll to see if we're voting someone off the island." And just because it's the prospect of voting someone off the island, it would be funny if everyone was like, "Haha, vote him off the island." XD. I imagine most people would have the majority saying yes. Like, if I were to make a poll right now that said, "Should I never stream again? Should I ban myself?" 75% plus would be yes. I can pretty much promise you. When it, I, I know for a fact that only 50% of people want me to stop streaming forever. Thank you for the 7 month resub, Steam Beals. I appreciate it, dog. How are you doing? Oh, I didn't do the down slash. I fucked that up. Car? This place is kind of spooky. Can't fucking see. That didn't go as expected. Alright. No, surprisingly enough, not really, Jezel. So so props there, I guess. Props where props are due. Although I'm not like if you do manage to get banned here, there aren't usually second chances. Okay. What's this? Oh, man. Alrighty. I need to kill this nasty mushroom. What would someone even get banned for here? Well, in Mistruri's case, it was just being a Oh, God. Extremely obnoxious, like, 100% of the time. Holy shit, what the fuck? What on God's green earth is this shit by Dr. Seuss? Okay, I need to go get health. Technically banned here, but I'm still here. I don't believe you. Amazing clip of this Chinese dude playing League, and it seems when he's super hard, the dude starts to surrender vote as a joke, and he freaks out. I've done that before. I think most people who have played League have fallen victim to the meme surrender vote. This is, this is part of playing League of Legends. Can you really say you played League if you haven't accidentally forfeited a winning game? I don't think so. Okay. Are there any more easy enemies so I can get some health? I think four hearts should be okay. And ban me instead? But it wasn't... Uh, very technically, I suppose you got banned. But you weren't... You weren't actually banned. Hello, Jail. To flow. Zero. Yep. Hopefully, hopefully people like it. That is, uh... I'm... I'm... Very, very, very nervous about it, so I hope I do good. Surrender to your AP sign is 20 0. Yup. I used to play AP sign, and I was that piece of shit. Oh. Okay. For a second, I thought I was fucking. Nope. I hate these ones where you have to drop. Those are the worst fucking ones. Wow. Huh? Yeah, fuck this part. Holy shit. I'm terrible with this. All right, we gotta go back. Gotta go get more health. Fuck. I can't do the dropping. Almost, almost every other facet I'm getting at least uh, competent at, but the drop dashes, no. I suck shit at that, as you can probably tell. Just uh, it makes me re remember the song I used to sing to my friends when they used to be doing poorly in video games. Uh, sucking on a big black hairy dick. 
Sucking on a big black hairy dick. Sucking on a big black hairy dick. This is pretty much me right now. I'm just taking a deep throw style. When's the Gundam stream? Tomorrow. Dash, man. I'm trying. I'm just not good at the timing. Oh, fuck. Okay. Oh, no. Not this shit again. I guess I can kill these little dudes. They respawn, huh? Hmm. Forced to play League? Oh, shit. He's not dead. I thought I hit him th thrice. Okay. Is your thing permanently broken the little orb at the top left one? Give me a second. One moment. Much better. Okay, I had, to, I had to type something. Sorry. But as far as I'm aware, my little thing's broken until I get my ghost back. But I'm never going to get my ghost back because it's in a pit that's inaccessible. So I guess until I die again, I'm just shit out of luck, basically. I think I, that the idea of building a podcast with chat is perfect for you. Well, maybe. We'll see. Oh, fuck. I didn't even see those, honestly. I'm not paying enough attention. Wow, holy shit. Let's have an impressive week. Oh, big hitbox. Okay, well, I'm fucked again. Damn it, dude. The fuck it. This part is, is rough. Holy shit, I can't do this worth a fuck. Alright, what's good, Kryson? How high up the dick is possible to grow hairs? That's an interesting thing to uh, wonder about. Way to get shade other way? I haven't figured it out yet. Or gotten it if it's like an item. Okay. The fuck is this? Sure. I didn't even know I had that. I guess this is where I'm supposed to go. Alright. Wait. Goodies? What's up here? Oh boy, more platforming. Just what the Dacta ordered. Oh, it's just shackles. What's good, Davian? Rather play League for 10 hours a week for the rest of your life? Or kick Sif and not say sorry? I've kicked Sif before accidentally. Sif is a dog that j is constantly orbiting me all of the fucking time. Um. When I was setting up the lights and shit in my room and getting everything set up, it was really annoying because I, I constantly had Sif orbiting me. 100% of the time. Like, I love Sif, don't get me wrong, but she can be very irritating in that regard. And when she's when she's hovering so close to you, it's very easy to accidentally knock her. Okay. What's good D2C? Cannon Fang. Oh man, that reach, holy shit. All right, those guys are kind of, kind of scary. But Doctor Seuss, what on earth is this shit? Do you think it's a game of joke? Nicely framed. What is this shit? Fuck this stuff. I can't do this worth a fuck. This is too tough. This shit. Is oh my god. What's going on, Polaris Sketches? How you been, man? My dog waits by my door and it pushes out, and bumps her every time. Yeah, yeah. Our, our golden retriever Angel does that too. Okay, those are those enemies are very rude. I'm I, I hope they die in one hit because if they don't. That's another fucking exploding enemy that I just gotta learn how to uh how to dodge. It's awesome seeing you play Hollow Knight. Don't worry, it'll get worse. Eventually we are going to get to a boss that's actually capable of killing us. More than a handful of times. Asshole run of Gundy, I found it to be parried. 
Oh yeah, Perrion Gundyr in any in any of his fights just makes the fight just completely snooze. It's not even remotely challenging. Like a, like a like an orangutan with a lumberjack axe st stuck in the center of its cranium would be able to beat Gundyr without or with parrying. Platforming would kill you more than any boss. I mean, that's just how the platforming uh, games work. It was the same thing with Wings of Eye. Like, the bosses were hard, but the platforming was way worse. Okay, so... I don't really like this position. Okay. Oh, man. You can hit behind him. That's fucked. Oh. What a goofball. This guy doesn't know what he's doing. Holy shit. Has so many dogs that think his yard might be a pile of dog poop? No. Okay. The magic ghost boss fight. Did you like the poem? Nope, not really. I don't I'm not I'm not into poetry. Oh shit, two of them, alright. Could you really call that a poem though? Does that mean Dr. Seuss books are poetry? Fuck you. Alright, they take five hits. Thank you for the two month resubs, you Colbster. I appreciate it, my man. Thank you very much, and I, I hope you've been well. What's good, dog? Bosses are generally way harder than the platforming in this game, but there's one area where the game becomes meat boy for a bit. I don't know, dude. Uh the the section with the worms in uh Deep Nest or whatever the shit it was called was it killed me more than like all of the bosses I fought combined. <laughs> that, that part was a little bit... Oh, can I jump down there? Will I... Oh, this is glass. I didn't even realize. I thought I'd be able to just jump down. Red Yurtle the turtle? No, I can't say I have. Sip, sit directly behind your chair. She used to, but she doesn't anymore. Okay, I'm, I'm stupid. That I had For some reason, I thought I was hitting this one to send it. That's just to call the elevator back. It took it took me a moment. That's my text and IQ showing. Okay. No hit DS3 any percent recently. Nice dude, good shit. How are you? I'm alright. I am uh I am mentally preparing myself for tomorrow. Tomorrow is probably going to be an eventful day, and so I'm just kinda of being a fat lazy slob today. Just played some fucking RuneScape, killed some stinky green monkeys, got some shekels. And I, I, that's pretty just that pretty much just my day. Just playing RuneScape, you know. Hello, Rhyme Scheme. CWC going to BronyCon. I actually don't know. Um, CWC got... Someone gave CWC like $1,000 to go to BronyCon or some crazy shit. But I think CWC spent too much of their social security money on like Transformer toys and shit. So they need to take that BronyCon donation and use it to pay bills? I think. I don't really know. I, I'm, I'm not an expert on CWC's finances, but I think that's what happened. Going on tomorrow, I am getting a shipment of live aquarium animals. One vampire shrimp and three peacock gudgeons. And it is the first time I've ordered fish on the internet, so I'm nervous that they'll be sick and I, I, and I won't be able to... I, I'm just nervous that that could go wrong, right? Um, and then I'm doing the Gundam stream tomorrow, which will be the first stream I've done that isn't a video game, and it's going to be very strange. Oh shit, I was trying to be clever. Owlboy? I haven't even heard of that one. New or old RuneScape? Is that really a question? That's like asking... God, what what is an accurate analogy for that? It's like asking me if I play with Legos or Mega Bloks, Ninja. Come on, dog. Of course I play old school. Come on. I don't. I refuse to believe that there are people who play RuneScape three unironically. It, it, just, it just cannot be. I don't believe it. That hot Cheeto sushi? No, that shit looks nasty. I like hot Cheetos and I like sushi, but both at the same time? No thanks. 
City of Tears. Like the the rain slick precipice of darkness. RuneScape 3, y'all. Thank you very much for putting Tyler1 in the cuck shed, Christ, and I appreciate it, dog. That's actually... He's been put in there a couple of times. I wonder if he likes my dog. Probably doesn't even notice. I've been gifted subs that I haven't even noticed before, and I'm, I'm a baby dick streamer, so... Okay, is this Bloodborne 2? Yes. Mark of Pride Charm? I don't think so. Oh, I kind of want to... If I had double jump, I could. Okay. Dude, yeah, I saw that. Thank you, by the way. I, I, I mean to thank you for that. I got excited because you thought you were in chat. Damn, that makes me feel bad. I'm just, I'm too antisocial. I, I, I'm, I have this problem where I don't talk in other streamers' chats typically unless I'm really close with the streamer in question, like Russ or Cry. Because I just, I'm fucking, uh... This, uh God, are you, are you ready for the 14-year-old emo Linkin Park shit? You ready for me to lay it on you? Cause I, I, I really feel like a fucking misfit on this goddamn website, to tell you the truth. I am, uh... <laughs> I'm kind of fucking weird. I, it, like, I remember... Back in the fucking day, like, God. Maybe two years ago at this point, it's when I first got partnered. I used to go into Squilla Killer's chat and talk a uh, Maybe not a lot, but fairly frequently. And... I'm kind of an asshole. So, I, I remember distinctly one time, he was playing, like, Bloodborne or some shit, and I went in there, and some fucking person was just talking about how, like, all of the bosses in Bloodborne get, like, new attack patterns and new moves and shit if you get, like, 90 inside, 99 inside or whatever the fuck. And I'm like, lol, well, you're fucking retarded. And I, I'm just sitting there, and... I'm like, no, that's that's not true. Uh, that's that's wrong. If you want, if you're gonna make claims like that, you should probably provide evidence. And uh, they got very upset with me, the person that I that I told that to. And I, I think I made it really awkward for Squilla because I'm just sitting here, like, basically instigating fights in in his chat. That, that's kind of how I am. Uh, like, if someone says something that I think is fucking retarded, I typically respond to it and, and uh, like. Okay, maybe not retarded, but if someone's spreading misinformation like that, I, I have, like, this natural urge to correct it. Like, the same thing happened in Riskum's chat. Like, some asshole was like, the, the, the best build by far in Bloodborne is, like, Arcane Kane or some shit. I'm just like, are you fucking high? What the hell is wrong with you? And, and Riskum was, like, he didn't know what to do because I was just fucking ripping into this dude. Like, it was a public execution. And, and, and Riskum's chat, and I'm like, yeah, I'm kind of an asshole, dude. I, I'm making it, like, I think I'm justified in that, uh... I think these people absolutely deserve to be called out on their shit, but I, I, I probably shouldn't do it in other people's streams. So I just kinda... I have to put a leash on myself, because I'm, I'm I'm kind of a douche. Okay. So I, I, I kind of restrained myself. Now I've learned I've learned more restraint over the years I think than I used to have. So I just I just I don't know. Stop being such a nerd. Okay, I'll I, I'll do my best. Hey, Bloodborne knows that Arcane's a meme. No, dude. No, this like that's what I'm saying is like it's not even so much me trying to be an asshole towards that person but i guess i come off strong and like i'll be like okay well that's not right uh because xyz and they take it as like a personal insult and then it ends up being like this little bitch slap fight between me and some random fucking internet user i'm not i'm not averse to confrontation uh I, i'm sure most of you know that by now um i will get into into retard slap fights immediately and readily 
I have I have no qualms whatsoever. But it's kind of rude to do that in other people's chat, so I just kind of isolate myself now. Yes, Butta Bing, I'm 100% positive. Because the Arcane Cane dude in particular, I, I, I know both of these were, were for real. Let me start with the first guy, the Insight guy. Um, I actually... Amazon did... Not Amazon, but the internet did its like weird thing where... If, if you come into contact with someone or talk about someone, it, like, recommends them to you. And I actually saw that person uh, in my recommended people on Twitter or whatever the fuck. And out of curiosity, I'm like, you know what? Let me see what that person's like uh, on Twitter. Maybe maybe they're they're a rational person or something. I, mean, I was kind of curious, you know, being a little snooky bastard. And it was like, I can't believe people on the internet sometimes. It's like this fucking diatribe about uh the conversation that was had in chat was like oh my god it basically just like this fucking two paragraph long sub tweet and like that's kind of fucking funny so i'm pretty sure that person was serious and the second one when we were having the discussion about the arcane cane they linked me video proof on the arcane cane being the best weapon in the game and it was like a 30 minute long video of them just going through some dumb fuck chalice dungeon doing like 400 damage a hit with the arcane cane. It's like, are you fucking high? You can, you think you can literally do more damage at BL4 with a Sog Thief. I'm like, okay, yeah, you know what? I don't even know why I talk to people. I really don't. <laughs> like, are you serious? Like, this is, this is your, your check and made atheists. Your, your proof that arcane. Kane is the best weapon in the game. The video where it takes like five minutes to kill Thumerian Descendant. Mm -hmm. So I guess I upgraded my sword. That's pretty cool. So yeah, short story long. I like to get into internet slap fights, and it's kind of embarrassing. So I calm my I calm my tits. Okay, that's a noticeable damage improvement. I like that. I should stop by uh, Happy Hob in his chat sometime. Oh, shit. Wait, do I not die for going in the water here? Okay, I didn't know that you can actually swim in a fucking platforming game. Are you out of your mind? Holy shit. Okay. Some people just need a Tard Wrangler. Absolutely. I know I do. Calm. Stream is more quiet than usual. Chat, am I quiet right now? Lost my rats. You're fine today. Okay. Scared me my first time falling in. A lot of other platformers. In the 3D ones, yes. I guess, I guess some of the 2D ones, too. But most games like this, if you fall like that, you're dead. Like, underwater in those games is usually, like, its own... Its own separate level. Like, if you're, if you're in a terrestrial level in, like, Super Mario World, like, if you're on the Donut Bridge and you fall like that, you're fucking dead, homie. Because a fish is going to eat your ass. I still want to go up there. The game's quiet? Do I need to turn the game up? Wait. Oh, killing those in one hit is nice. Okay. Game also sounds fine to me. All right. <laughs> that dude can't swim though. That that guy can't swim at all. Big ol' fat beetle. Huh? Maybe up it a little bit. Oh, all right, all right. In the SNL stream? What what the fuck? Is, you, like Saturday Night Live? You actually like I unironically watch that shit? What the fuck is wrong with you, emo? 
Jesus Christ, like, I, I knew you were throttled, but not on that level. God damn. Okay. It becomes a Twitch thought. Oh, absolutely. I'm gonna, like, I'm gonna show up to my stream tomorrow. There's gonna be a bit cup. Like, donate, bitch, right now! And the stream is, is... It is gonna go away. I'm gonna hold content hostage. If you want me to stream, you gotta sub, Dad. Five minutes per sub. I hate that shit, honestly. Like that is that is one of my triggers. When when streamers hold content uh, hostage for fucking money. Got him. That really real? Oh yeah, yeah. It's more common than you might think, too. Turn your microphone off. Yup, yup. That's the low-tier god strategy. That an actual thing? Yeah, low-tier god used to do this thing like, Oh, get that ass bed worth a specimen. Donate $20 if you want webcam. 50 if you want mic. Or something like that. If I don't get $100 in donations within the first two hours of the stream, then I'm gonna fuck off. Life is about time and revenue. You drones. Some people are ridiculous. Oh look, he's chubby. Wow, okay, he was... I think the other ones are, uh... Are harder. He knows how to hustle. Does he really, though? Does he really? I will say, though, I respect low-tier god shit-talking prowess. That is what, like, I don't like a lot of the things about low-tier god, but his ability to talk hella shit on a worthless specimen is something to be respected. Like, I remember the first time I heard low-tier god call someone a lardvark. I was just like, are you fucking serious? That's a galaxy brain insult. Jesus Christ. Like, there are not too many people who shit talking I'm impressed with. The low tier god is is a He he has artisan insults. Fucking gravy bloods. Thank you for the three month resub, Rogue Bear. I appreciate you using that prime sub on me again, dog. How are you? TV show. Yeah, he did, but he got eliminated in, like, the first round. Which is pretty funny. Insults. I mean, that's good, though. That's good. Okay. I hear the grubs somewhere, but I don't know how to get to them yet. Shit. Alright, we'll go back up here in a bit. Mm, mm, mm. Now there's no reason to watch. Yeah, I have zero. I or I had zero interest uh, in anyone on that show besides LTG. My power goes to eating ice cream. It's my fucking mom. She only eats ice cream and sweet potatoes. I have to be her tard wrangler because she's gonna get like diabetes if she keeps doing that shit. I've stolen her ice cream before. Woman, you're gonna fucking die if you keep eating that shit. You need to stop. Oh, that wasn't a grub at all. I thought the nice happy noise was one of the grubbies. Fix your health pool? Yeah, but my, my ghost is in an inaccessible location, so I'm not going to go retrieve him right now. It's not really a big deal, honestly. Hey, I actually avoided it for once. The really scared bug? I don't know how yet. I'm going to go back eventually. You know what I need to find? I need to find the map for this uh, level. Okay. Those bats are the worst. I have a real important test more than study, dog. Hello, Oscar. Sign me up. 
Is that why you've recently become a vegetarian soy boy? No, I don't want to die at the age of like fucking 30 because I eat too many hot Cheetos. That's why I started eating veggies. Wow, I really just can't get up here, huh? Okay. Wait, hold on. No, I want to go up. No. Ah, that would have been cool if there was something there. Are you fucking with me? That's fucked up. Alright. I don't know how I feel about that one. <laughs> that was kind of rude. Okay. Thank you for the six month resub, Kanta. What's good, dog? How you been? Okay, so I fucked this up. Trying to eat more vegetables. It's hard. No, dude. Spinach is just disgusting. I don't know how Popeye does it. Alright. Invest one of those appetite suckers by Kim K. Appetite suckers, huh? Appetite suckers by Kim Kardashian. I'm gonna- will that make me talk like Kim Kardashian? Will that give me the nice vocal fry? Like, yo, what up, dude? It's your boy, Talom, yo. Oh, how you doing today? We're gonna be playing Hollow Knight. We're gonna be getting real deep in this bitch tonight, fellow gamers. I hope you're all doing well. Cause I'm down. Making fun of my fry again? I mean... Only kind of fry I like is a French fry. I'm American. Oh, okay. Uh, sex tapes with Ray J. Alright. Mix that shit with lettuce, tomato, sweet peppers, and you won't taste it at all. I mean, that's the thing. Like, spinach sucks because it doesn't have a taste. Like, it's just this... Ah. It's just irredeemable. I would prefer if it had a bad taste and no taste at all. I feel like I'm eating Soylent or something. That's what I should do. I should become a soy boy and just order like 20 crates of Soylent. Uh-oh. Alright. I have throat problem, you insensitive white man. Stop sucking so much dick. <laughs> so I'm juvenile today. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, if you, I, I'm, I'm gonna fight you. You don't wanna, oh, okay. I, I, I know it's all memes, but I, I don't think that Soylent is going to fucking poison your brain and make you a, uh, in, into, you, you know. Doesn't Snake drink Soylent as well? You're juvenile every day? No, that's just not true. That's patently false. Because if I was juvenile, I'd be singing back that ass up all the time. Checking me, Atheist. What's good, Marvin? This is, this is Bug Knight. Literally a protein shake with soybeans on it. I mean... Soy sounds disgusting, though. Like, my problem with Soylent is that it... I'm, I'm almost 100% sure it tastes like dog shit. Because soy tastes like dog shit. Because I actually think the idea of being able to say, Yo, fuck, I don't feel like eating right now. Let me just drink something and, and my appetite is, uh, flashed. I, I like that prospect, but it's not from Soylent. I know it's it's based off of soil and green walrus. I, I'm I am aware of that. Believe it or not. Didn't it also used to have like really high levels of lead or some shit in it, and it got like banned or recalled or whatever? This seems like a great product. This kind of looks like a. Yup. Who the fuck is this?
Oh shit, those home, okay. This guy seems quite rude. Wow, that, that tracking is crazy. He didn't teleport when I hit him that time. Okay. No, he wasn't even a boss. This is a normal enemy. I'm just getting fucked by the normal enemies, I guess. So just went in on him. Okay. The soul sanctum, huh? I'm not I was not expecting that level of projectile tracking. No, those shits were. Okay, I hear the map dude, but I have no idea where he is. See down here. Hey, thanks for the bits, Burning Little Max. I appreciate it, dog. Thank you very much. I have dash, I have this. Oh, I see, okay. There's a nice cracked wall. Alright, give me the map, dude. Mm hmm. Uh-huh. Cornifer is a dumb name, by the way. Is this Dark Souls now? Yup, yup. Alright, so let's see. Um, I think we've explored the majority of this. That room in the bottom middle, the way it's drawn, highly suggests that that thing I was trying to do earlier will actually lead me somewhere. But I need, like, a double jump or something to do it. It's the remaster, yup, yup. Okay. Don't bully Cornifer. You're a dub name. True, my name is Kyle. People tell me my name sounds gay all the time. Okay. Alright. You do have a person name? Yeah, yeah, my real name's not Tolo, believe it or not. Like, I don't, I don't go downstairs, and they, uh, my sister's like, oh, hey, Tolo! That, so, believe it or not, that doesn't happen. Being rude to the nice map, man, I mean, that's me, I'm just degenerate. Also, what's good, dog machines? I don't think I said hello to you, I'm, I'm a piece of shit, sorry. Just a real asshole. Yeah. Hello, Peregrine, BMO. Does Sif think your name is Tolo? Sif thinks my name is oh At least that's what she calls me. Okay. My brother's named Kyle. He also has a pretty gay name. Oh. Interesting. Oh, wait. Wait. Wasn't this dude getting devoured in the in the deep nest? The last time we saw him? Why are you here? Okay, that's kind of... Bizarre. Save no, I didn't save him in the deep nest. I couldn't figure out how to get in the little room with the spider webs and shit. I left him to die. He just laughed. He just said, you know what? Fuck this spider. And, and just, just... Just dipped? Alright, that's kind of confusing. He saved himself? That's impressive. I guess he, he is a kind of... Oh, are you serious? I didn't even pay attention to those spikes. Alright. This nail upgrade is rough. Because now, now it... Uh, I can't hit enemies as often to get my, my soul back and heal. Oh shit, she completely missed and I jumped into it. God. <laughs> These fucking enemies. Holy shit. Okay. What's up here? Is there anything? There's gonna be more bee people. Is fucked around that and you're supposed to meet him in deep nest after city? Gosh. So I, I I did things in the wrong order is what you're telling me. 
Character also a bug. Yeah, yeah. The the plot line is there's a group of degenerates who are trying to chase him and acquire him. So what the fuck is this? I have no clue. I have a lot of trouble with the flying ones. Now I... It's gonna take me like 15 minutes at least to get back to where I was. Like, there was apparently a bench that I had missed there. Maybe I can go back. I did open a shortcut. I don't know if I can actually get over there yet, though. Later, Mr. Knot. I need to try to conserve some of my my soul. Oh, now that I died again, I can go get my thing and actually have full soul finally. All right. Can we get a hello from Sif? Nah, she's sleeping right now on the other end of the room. She also likes sleeping under the new table. Right. You paid for a bench tight? What do you mean? Paid for the bench? I didn't even know that's what it did. I wasn't paying attention. I just paid for it. Thought it like would open a door or something, because that's usually what they do. I didn't even realize. I'm observant, as you can tell. I guess I'm a little bit too out of it today. Even more so than normal. It's all good. We'll make our way back there. We'll farm some shekels. Very touchy with some mini quests. If you want to access every single boss. Oh, so you're telling me there's a lot of bosses I can miss? That kind of sucks dick. I don't like that. I don't think I'm going to be doing multiple playthroughs of this game, at least not immediately. That'd, that'd kind of suck if I miss bosses. The best emotes? Hell yeah, I do, because they're, uh, they're a little Miss Sif. <laughs> What would you do if you won the lottery? Um... I would probably just fuck off and then live a, a modest life. At least that's what I tell myself. That's one of those things where you can't really... You can't really say what you're gonna do with like seven gorillion dollars until you're actually in that position. So I can sit there and say, well, I would probably, you know, invest it and spend it wisely and just live a, a modest life and never have to worry about working. But I'd, I'd probably just, like, spend it all on fucking... on, on goat rides or something. Like, just go to go to the, the state fair and ride the ponies forever. So who really knows? One of Celtics you paid for, picked up, and done that, really. Because the thing is, this is one of those things where if I, if I'm like, yeah, tell me, uh, tell me if X happens, then people are going to start telling me when Y happens, too. Like, basically, if I, if I tell people to only tell me about things that will fuck me over, like if I'm going to miss out on a boss fight or something, then people will interpret that as, oh, he, he missed the room for the boss, go back and like to the left two rooms and go fight this guy. And people will get out of control very quickly, I think. What's going on, Mason Smitty? Alright. Would you buy me a sub? No, probably not. I don't think so. <laughs> like, I, I, I'll be honest. I don't, I don't think... Uh, if, if I were to win the lottery, I don't think I'd be like, Yeah, dude, uh, I'm gonna go buy people subs on Twitch. Unless they were fucked up subs to, like, streamers that they didn't like, then maybe. We came to 20k with Goodall and dumb shit in three weeks. Yeah. That's just kind of... That's just kind of how people are. I, I like to think that because I've, I've, I know what it's like to have, like, no fucking money. Because that's, that's how I, it was when I was a teenager. That I wouldn't do that. But I, I'm probably just lying to myself. What's this? 
Simple key. Buy one of those touchscreen soda machines? Nope, don't think so. Buy them subs to Tolomeo? No, nah, no. Nah. Everyone loves me, dude. What are you talking about? Name one person who doesn't like me. You can't. Buy a Whataburger. I probably buy a lot of Whataburgers. Craddock? I, I said person. See, that's the language that I use. You need to pay more attention to the, to the words that come out of my mouth. I say name one person who doesn't like me, and you, you say someone who's not even a person. Come on. Do you like you? No, not really. Sif? No, Sif loves me. That dog. That dog would be lost in life without me. No one else would be able to, uh... To deal with some of the shit she does. <laughs> Professor Wiggles MD. Oh, thanks for putting Craddock in the cuck shed, Christ. And I appreciate it, dude. That's fucked up, though. You think a corporate franchise would be worth owning? Depends on the person. For me, no. Fuck that, but... Would you be... No, I'd be lost without Sif. If Sif were to, like... If something were to happen to Sif, my will to, to keep going in life would be diminished very quickly. That would, that would be terrible. Sif is my best friend. Oh, this is the weird-ass beetle thing. I want a ring just because I want to see him. <laughs> Look at him. <gasps> All right. I guess we go on this way. I would buy a $15,000 sex doll. Okay, CWC. Joy! Joy! I also remember CWC have one called Officer Nasty, too. <laughs> what a great name. A little, a little police officer. Officer Nasty. I think I know where this is going to take me. This is going to take me to Crossroads, isn't it? Yep. But I haven't been able to get over to this side, so let's see what's over here. It's one of, it's one of these little uh, virgin bugs. The virgin jumping beetle versus the Chad horn beetle. Okay. That's fucked up. Would you say would you pay CWC for a blowy? The concept of someone giving CWC money for a sexual favor seems absolutely out, out of uh, out of this universe, honestly. Like you would have to pay me to even consider that. Can a bug be a Chad? I don't see the problem. Okay. I mean, I got an achievement called Soulful. Did you pay for the CWC celebrity visit? I would not want CWC within 50 miles of my, my sister, my mother, or my dog. Keep in mind, this is a CWC who, for one of their potential mates, talked about uh, fucking a dog, basically. So, that's not the sort of person I want around me. And thank you for the 10 bits, I'll fail. But no. Okay. Mm, where to go now? I think I'm done in this general area. 
Gotta go back over this way. TMC did come to your house, what would you do? I'd sit there and chuckle as my army of fucking dogs screamed at CWC and they kind of just... Uh... Sold back into the shadows from whence they came. Okay. Outrun Sonichu. I, I can. I can. I have a cat named Sonichu. I can outrun that cat. Okay. Send the rat army. Ugh. I guess we do have rats too, I suppose, but they wouldn't be of much use. I remember I used to play a game called Shadow of the Colossus with my sister's rats. Where I would get all of them and put them on, like, my shoulders and shit. And they'd hang on, and then I'd sit there and just, like, kind of half-ass shake to see which one fell off last. I'd do it on, like, a bed, of course, so they wouldn't, like, like get hurt or anything when they fell. But I thought it was kind of funny. They scratched the shit out of me. Rats have sharp claws. So you're saying you let him near Amanda? Amanda would... Oh, God. Amanda would probably have a meaner reaction than I would, to be quite honest. Probably deserved them. Yeah, yeah, I did. Those rats were weird. Remember, my sister used to just let them out to wander the house for some fucked up reason? And one of them... Only one of them... It, her name was Mocha, would be like, yo, dog, I'm gonna go to Kyle's room. Every time. And I, so I'd be sitting here playing, like, video games. I'd like, play League of Legends or whatever the fuck I would play back then. And I just had this rat, like, tickle my fucking feet. And I didn't know it was a rat at first. So this scared me, this scared the fuck out of me the first time. And I started, like, stomping, trying to get whatever the fuck it was. I thought, I thought it was, like, a bug or something. Uh, and then I see that it's my sister's rat, and I'm like, oh my god, I almost fucking... I almost, I almost made wine out of my sister's rat, and I told her, don't, don't do that again. So she did it again, and it happened a second time, but I knew what it was. And it would always come and visit me. It really liked me. Like, if I let it, it would crawl up to my face and, like, pry my lips apart and, like, kiss my gums. It was really weird. Oops. So it was, it was kind of sweet that it showed affection towards me, but... Like, what the fuck? That's so strange. Rest in peace, Mocha. You were the best rat. That was my favorite rat, just because it was nice to me. Then then her newest rat, I don't know what it's called. I told her to name it Gunther, but I don't think she did. Uh, I call it the Mad Rat, because if you go anywhere near its cage, it's sitting there like all four legs are on the bars and it's exposing its genitalia towards you and it's sitting there like biting the fucking bar and son again. it's a mad rat Bellamy Arthur. wanderer's journal huh so I can sell these huh yeah I'll sell them sure Get why not out. Lee is okay Bellamy Arthur. Oh, Paul. Bellamy Arthur. I I should probably not sell everything just so I don't lose all my shackles. Well, actually, hold on. You know what? We just unlocked a shortcut up there that takes me to the uh, the crossroads, so I I can sell all this shit and just make my way back to the village, maybe. And then go Bellamy buy everything, Arthur. just buy them out. Whatever happened to the Bellamy huge rat your sister had? I think she still has that Bellamy one. Delka. I don't really keep up with them. They, rats don't live very long. They only live a couple years. So I think that one's still alive, but I'm not sure. The biggest rat we ever had, I named it, and I named it the Quest. So, literally, that, that's where T-Dog and the Quest came from. And... She's not with us anymore, but she was a fat, mean rat. The fattest rat we've ever had, for sure. The giant rat that makes all the all of the rules, one might say. 
You like fried chicken? Who the fuck doesn't like fried chicken? What kind of degenerate does not like fried chicken? That'd be fucked up. That would be embarrassing if you were a human being. Yeah, I don't like fried chicken. Okay. This is not where I wanted to go at all. Okay. No, I'm gonna go up. Makes me f sick as fuck. But the fact that you wish you could still eat it still means you kind of like it. See, you wish you could eat it even though it makes you sick. That's the power of fried chicken. The huge amount of grease in fried chicken makes me ill. Absolutely pathetic. You're gonna let a little bit of grease defeat you? Disgusting. So wait, where the fuck do I go? Taste of fried chicken, but makes my stomach hurt? I'm actually kind of surprised to hear so many people having issues with fried chicken. That'd suck. House flipper is out? What the fuck is that? Oh, oh, oh god. <laughs> My fucking leg hurts so much, dude. I have to oh shit. Thank you for the raid, Mr. Russ Money. What's good, dog? Thank you very much. Hello, Al Toast, Wolfotic, Salami, Biggie, Spinetto, Denaro86, Eileen Kelly, Cyrix Burns, Lady Risu, J Marv. How's everyone doing? Um, Risu, you better be here tomorrow because we're doing the Gundam stream and you're gonna get to see Sif. Won't be, won't be full body, but you'll be able to see her, her silly little face at the very least. But thank you very much, Mr. Money. What's good, dog? How's God of War 2 going? Hmm. Is it better or worse than the, uh, the first? Hello, Cribbed. I don't have his emotes. Oh, what's good, Honest? We were just, I was just talking earlier how I didn't want to be you. I have to talk about those stream titles. What's wrong with my stream titles? This is what this is the clickbait. Man, my greed always oh, good. Lost in fantasies. How are you doing, dog? I like this little thorn thing. Hey, leave me alone, asshole! Oh, this thing's kicking my ass. It's about the same puzzles are more convoluted than the first, so what's worse is what you're telling me. Got it. Talk about me when I'm not around? Yeah, because you ruined the word honest for me. Now when someone's like, Tolo is honest, and I'm like, don't fucking say that. Don't say that to me. Love fried chicken, but fucking barbecue chicken on the grill? What bosses have you beat since the last stream? I haven't found a boss. I'm, I've just got to this area, and I'm fucking around. I play games slowly. The last boss I meet, I beat in general was the Mantis Lords. The Mantis Lords. Huh? Saying Tolo's honest? I mean, what? Do you have examples of me not being honest? Probably not. Okay. God of War 2's maps are way cooler than 1's. I'm happy to ruin words we secret hit, but that's not... The entire point of that game is to not be honest, though. That's not really... <laughs> like, what the fuck? You got me? Yeah, yeah, don't don't say things you can't back up. That's kind of retarded. You know, you wouldn't want to be a retard, would you? You want an example? Okay, an example that does not involve a game where the entire purpose is to be dishonest. You pick up the Mantis charm? I don't think so. Okay. I'm happy to ruin words for you, friend, though. Not the only thing you've ruined for me. 
Go back to the drag queen in the place you found the fly? Maybe later. Lie? Tola wouldn't bang CWC? Oh, man. Do you... Okay, enough memeing. Do you think there exists a person who really genuinely wants to fuck CWC? Not because of, like, what epic memes or something or to say, uh, oh, yeah, I fuck CWC, but, like, is genuinely attracted to CWC kind of fuck. Do you think that person exists? You think someone sees that seaweed hair and goes, oh, yeah, it's just like the little mermaid. Holy shit. And just pops a fucking pen. Threesome. You realize the threesome situation uh, is CWC being in a relationship with uh, their OCs. So Magichan and some other Sonichu that they made, right? Like, not real people. Mm -mm -mm. Type person who keeps up with the goings on is CWC. I don't think anyone who keeps up with CWC who knows who they are would be the ones who fuck them, though. I think, like, if you were to find someone who was wanting to fuck CWC, the biggest chance would be the fact that CWC goes to BronyCon. Um, that's really the only sort of person I think would show any interest. That I can think of. Who the fuck would BronyCon attendees? You're a mean boy, why? Fast travel to that town from that bench you sat at. Oh yeah, the little uh little dog thing could have taken me over there. That's the kind of question that makes me feel ashamed of being human. You should never be ashamed of questions. Answer is any chick he pays enough. CWC would participate in a BronyCon orgy. A BronyCon orgy, huh? What's going on, Hades D? Um, just, just that... <sighs> a BronyCon orgy. What Jesus Christ. I don't want to think about that for too long. Yeah, let's go buy this. Yeah, why not? Let's buy this. Okay. How you doing? I'm alright. How about you? What's good, Melon Fox? I managed to fuck my leg up in my sleep. I completely destroyed my leg. I, I got like a Charlie horse or something in my sleep against all odds. I woke up in excruciating pain and thought it was a dream until I woke up and I could barely walk. So, uh, aside from that, I'm alright, but that was interesting. The game's enjoyable. Yeah, the game's fun. I like it. Actually, you know what? Hold on, I have the lantern now. That means maybe I could go to that crystal area. Or not, not the, the area below the crystal area, the one that's dark. The crystal area, I need like a ground pound or some shit, because there's... Like a rumbling floor that I can't get past. You become numb. It's not numb. It just fucking hurts. Like it hurts to step or like uh, extend any of the muscles in my right calf. Like the the stairs suck. Like I have to I I have to like hop down the stairs on one leg. And so I'm probably gonna die when I go for a break to get like a drink or something. I'm gonna be hopscotching down the stairs and fall, and you're just gonna hear a, Ooh! It's gonna be great. Oh, what's good, Leslie? How are you doing, dog? It's not this way. It's down there. The only solution is amputation? Aw, oh, damn. Hella good. How about you? I'm alright. I'm chilling. Glad to hear you doing well. Just got out of a hospital with a blood... Dude, I hope it's a blood clot. Maybe then I can just fucking... Uh, I'll, that'll, that'll be the debut uh, Gundam stream. I'm just gonna be building a Gundam and then I'm just gonna fucking keel over and die. And I'm gonna be on the table and the webcam will be there and everything. So, uh, these things look friendly. Perfect. 
hurt them. You know, I, I had a feeling I couldn't, but it doesn't hurt to try. What's he doing? Is he scared? Oh, I can't hurt him. Just have to hit their faces. Alright. Oh, and there's goodies over here, too. Spend your shekels. I just spent all of them. I just spent like 2.5k. I got the lantern in a mask shard. See, I got, I got my little, uh, my little, my little light bright. And Sif would be sad. Might finally make it to... No, I've made it to livestream fails. I've gotten to the top of livestream fails, as a matter of fact. It wasn't on my channel, though. I, I, I got on to... I got cry onto the top of livestream fails from a joke that I told once. It was that bad. So... <laughs> I'm a good friend! Link? Someone can get the link, I guess. I, I'm not gonna look for it. Sorry. If you just look cryotic livestream fails, you might find it. No, Zero, it was a different one, although that happened too. That wasn't on livestream fails, so that was on the top of the Dark Souls 3 subreddit. The speedrun joke, yeah, it was a speedrun joke. We were playing golf. I won't reiterate the joke, but I, I gotta say it was a pretty good one. Just gonna go ahead and suck my own dick there for a second. The milk meme? Aw, oh, damn, I remember that. I, I, I felt so bad for that. I betrayed Russ's trust. I'm showing him, like, these fucked up, like, uh, porn images where the, like, the dick is, is has, like, a, has a joystick painted out. So it's this girl just, like, right wrestling with a dick, but it looks like a joystick. It's like, I'm such a gamer girl caption or whatever the fuck. <laughs> he, he brought it up on stream. It's it's really a wonder I haven't been banned at all yet, huh? Man, live stream fails is way too easy. I mean, yeah, you could just you could post right now and get yourself on live stream fails. You could you could seriously just clip this right now what I'm saying currently, and you could get it on the live stream fails now because you get it to the top of live stream fails is the question. Yeah, yeah, Kylo's got it. High Reddit, Epic Reddit. I fucking love Reddit. I don't get the joke. That's probably good. It's it's an offensive joke. It's not a joke that was made in good taste. Is it super tofu boy? Yep, what's going on, Sepis? How are you, dog? Do you still play Monster Hunter World, homie? What have you been playing recently? Oh, it's this happy little mining bug again. He's talking about burying their parents or some shit. Oh no, it's not the happy mining bug at all! This one's fucking mean! That's fucked up. I guess that one wasn't singing, that was the tell. Is that the, the happy friendly one was singing shit. I don't like those spikes over there. God of War and Terra? Oh, Terra, damn, dude. How is that game these days? These are some tanky little bastards now, good god. Are these... Okay, I thought those things were spikes. Those little pointed edges on the conveyor belt. So I was trying to avoid them so I wouldn't get splatted. It appears unnecessary though. Terra still exists, see it? 
It's mad, but it's freeing something to play with friends. Got you. No, I'm not. I'm not talking shit. I used to play Terra back in the day. I mean, when I played it before they nerfed like the big ass monsters, it was probably my favorite MMO, honestly, at least combat wise. What are your charms? I don't know. I think I have the thorn charm, the one that shows me on the map in the first one you get. Tolo, I bought a t-shirt. I hope I don't get made fun of. Well, you probably will in here because you're buying something that's, uh... I'm assuming you're talking about my t-shirt. Uh... But in real life, now nah, you should be fine. Thank you very much. Appreciate it, dog. Oh, okay. That was not good. Oh shit, okay. Wait, how the fuck? I need to look at that one better. Can I even make that one? Oh, I think I see what I need to do. I probably need to go over that little lip and then not try to go the entire distance but hug the wall on the one that's uh, on the right. I think that's what they want you. Oh, damn, okay. How's the game? It's good. I just suck at platforming, as you can probably tell. God damn it. Hello, Megamorphton. Skull Candy. And Rogue Darshan. I'm sorry, dude. Why would you even want to be greeted by a toxic masculinist such as myself, Rogue? I fucked it up. That is exactly what I need to do, but I fucked it up. What's going on, Hank? Cosmic Nagi. I've had a t-shirt since, like, this time last year. I actually want to get a new one now. I want to do one t-shirt a year, roughly. So I'm in the market for a second one. At, uh, but... Okay. Those last conveyor belts went a bit faster. I almost got fucked. One shirt a year? Well, no, no, no. The thing is, I don't want to just overwhelm people with shit to buy. You know what I mean? Like, oh shit, buy my shirt, and then three months later, I'll buy my shirt. I I don't ever want to just, like, be constantly hawking shit at people. You know what I mean? I want to overdo it. Okay. New one had your face? Absolutely not. Okay. Oh, oh, oh. Shit, I didn't do my down slash quick enough. One hour pre stream about sub count and shirts. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, like like yeah, Jake Paul is the uh the definition of subtle. I'm probably not going to be able to make this, huh? Oh, I can. Wait, what the fuck? Can I pogo off these crystals? Oh my god. Okay. Damn it. What the shit? Alright. Bought more Switch games. I haven't touched my Switch in a while. Chat, am I retarded? Is wishful. Mm hmm. Playing with the controller? I'm doing the controller. What's going on, black dresses? I think I need to bounce on it twice to get more air. Okay. Wow, I'm all the way back here. Holy shit, okay. <laughs> but we've gotta we we've gotta go on a pilgrimage to get back over there. Okay. Oh. I'm probably gonna lose all of my shit. It seems likely. They give Apollo a snack. You know what they're gonna say, bro. Come on. Don't don't hold Snackies hostage. 
take the dog train? I guess I could. So good. I need to remember the dog train is a thing. See yourself as a worthless fuck, but god damn it to be one of the coolest dogs I've come across on Twitch. Well, I appreciate that, dog. But I'm just an asshole. I'm just a cum-guzzling retard. Highest I'll go is five snackies. What Hollow Knight really makes for me is you can pogo some areas without additional powers. Yeah, it, it seemed like I could do it. The, uh, the crystal area, it looked like I'd be able to make that last jump if I had managed to dash at the height of my pogo. I don't think I did. So, we should, we should try that again. I need all of my simoleons back anyways. Car? Is a beard for no reason? What? Where did that come from? Hyrule Warriors. Oh god. I, I haven't heard the, about that shit in a while. Okay. How are you liking the game so far? I like it. I'm just shit at the platforming parts. I just got... I got my ass beat by a platforming section just now. In spectacular fashion. I should probably see if I can find a bench before I do that again. Is there a bench nearby? I should rest at that. If that one is closer than the one that I spawn at. Thank you for the six month resub, Apahar. I appreciate it and thank you very much, man. Okay. Kill this stupid fucking bug. What a piece of shit. Alright, so this should be the bench. Yeah. Oh, this dude's here again. Pretty sure this dude told me I had a sand enema earlier. Yeah, sand enema. Yes, he's sand enema. You're the best Twitch personality, hands down. I appreciate you saying that. I don't really agree, but it, it means a lot. I think the best person Twitch personality has got to be... Chibi. Without a doubt. Like that. The jumping jacks he did at AGDQ. Mm, God damn. Fucking Myron. Zelda style Dynasty Warriors. The last game I played that was Dynasty, Dynasty Story. I can't speak. Sorry. Dynasty Warriors style. Uh, was di the first Dynasty Warrior Gundam. Sensei, I have to do the P. Okay, can can I confide in you guys? Can I can I tell you something that I'm kind of embarrassed about? But I kind of want to get off of my chest. No? Okay. So let me beat the shit out of this bug. So I need to get back to the part with the little crystal lasers. I wonder if I'll be able to do it without an upgrade. Because someone said I'm not supposed to be there doing that just yet. But now that makes me... That, that emboldens me, honestly. Huh? Best Gundam game I've ever played. I Mobile Suit Gundam on PS2. They really are not good at making fucking Gundam games. That's one thing that kind of sucks. Like, Gundam Versus was okay, but it didn't have the player base to support it. But what I was going to say is that uh, I was listening to the Nianners version of Anaconda. I went on a YouTube pilgrimage that it led me to that point. I'm, just, I'm sitting here just about to start the stream listening to fucking Nianners Anaconda. It was kind of a surreal experience, to be, to be perfectly honest. I liked it, though. I 
looking for benches in all the wrong places. I can't listen to any of those songs without hearing Yanners. I wish I could do a better Yanners voice. Dude, you know what would be the best fucking collaboration of all time? Low tier god and Nanners. Can you fucking imagine? That would be beautiful. Dude, holy shit, this place looks like a like a handful. I'm just looking for a bench. There are a lot of grubs in the crystal cave, huh? Oh, shit, went a little too far. Hey, I got you, buddy. Oh yeah, I've heard, I've heard her do tipsy as well. That one's good. Where the fuck is the bench? Where the fuck is the bench? Checkpoints in this game are pretty few and far between, huh? A what? Huh? <laughs> fucking shooting exploding jizz crystals on me. It took me a second to realize what was happening. I didn't realize they, uh... They expanded into that little crystal mass at first. Okay. Hello, Trinity Vince. I'm gonna get drunk tonight because I don't have work tomorrow. Nice, dude. You should probably save some for the Gundam stream, though. That's gonna be a shit show. You're gonna, you're gonna want to be very drunk for that, I think. Imagine all of the boring, asinine commentary of a typical Tolomeo stream, except no video games to make it bearable. It's gonna be great. Still no fucking checkpoint, Jesus Christ. I don't think I'm ever gonna find one. Shit. What? Okay. Quick for that one, huh? Is the Gundam stream at the regular start time tomorrow? It should be 11 my time if I had to warn, I guess. Either 10 or 11. It depends if... If Cry forces me into servitude. I'm gonna come back later. I don't want to lose all of my life on that. Can't hit these little dudes, right? Alright, worth. I just oh shit. Oh my god, these dudes are relentless. Okay. Shitty pop music? No. Walk past the cam? No. Spam rats, you can do whatever your heart desires as long as you're prepared to face the potential consequences of people who don't like rats. Is there there's some people who do not who do not understand 
the rat culture. I really don't like the emotes being spammed in chat right now. I'm gonna be- now I know what it's like for people to have rats spammed in their chats. So... I feel like we're never gonna find another boss at this rate. Total face the laser boss. Oh, nice spoiler, dude. Fuck! Why would you say that? Nah, I haven't. Oh, well, this is delightful. Bug! This is where I gotta go to get the map, though. I pretty much just tanked my way through that one. What's up here? Okay. I thank you for the 100 bits, Bernie. I appreciate it, dog. Thank you very much. It's very nice of you. I'm gonna get the map. Thank God. Oh, thank God. Mm -hmm. 112. Well, that's a weird number. Goodbye, Hank. Oh, I like the Majin Buu emote. That's dope. Oh, there is a bench. It's, it's down there. Okay. That's our first order of action then. It's a nice chicken emote, too. I like that one as well. Alright, so I managed to actually... It's a lot easier to go back than it is to go through that initially. Surprise, surprise, right, fellow gamers? Oh! They have contact damage. I didn't know that. You know, it's a good thing there's no fall damage. Need to contribute? Oh no, it's all good. I don't mind. It's, it, it, it's kind of a boring stream so far, so people are entertaining themselves by posting the emotes. It's all good. I'm just, I'm not very energized today. I'm sorry. Less famous than that. Do tell me you are. Because that's most of my, my streaming has been under the name Tolomeo R. Tell me what you find, by the way. Okay. Prince of Egypt? You don't sleep, so there is that? I sleep. Oh, I woke myself up by being an asshole today. <laughs> Fucking my leg up. Can you roll your R's? Oh, can I tell you a fucked up story? I actually have a story about rolling my R's. This is like a cringe moment, I guess, for lack of a better descriptor. What's going on in the case, Hansel? All right. Um. So as a lot of you probably know, I'm a fucking weird, pasty white dude. Okay. So basically, I was eating at a restaurant and I ordered some manner of alcoholic beverage. I'm not paying attention. Uh, our, and this is, this is not meaningless information. This is, uh, this is, okay, actually, you know what? Let me, let me go, let me take a step back. I can't roll my R's. I cannot roll my R's with the fuck. I, like, I can try and go, but that's, it's not really the same thing. I can't do it if they just, I actually have to pronounce a word like that. Like, retard. Uh, it, it doesn't work. It just sounds fucking weird. Um, and... Girlfriend's Hispanic. And they can all roll their R's. Like, it's a universal thing for them. They have that ability. 
Hello, Joni. And so, anyways, now, back to where we were with the restaurant. Some dude brings me the drink, and he, he's an African-American gentleman. Um, and the drink I ordered had rum in it. And so he goes up going, rum, rum, arr, rum. He's like, he's having a good day. And he's like, he's like, I'm not going to give you my drink, or give you your drink until you roll your R's. And I'm like, just, just absentmindedly, you know what I said in all of my social poise and elegance? I just said, no, nah, I can't do that, dog. I'm white. And he just looks at me like, what? And he goes, what does that have to do with anything? And I'm like, oh, fuck. <laughs> I'm like, oh, I can't believe I've done this. I'm like, oh, shit, I made a fucky wucky, a real, a real fucko boingo. I'm like, ah, that came out wrong. I'm sorry. So, that's me. Uh, if you ever want to go out, it, like, that kind of ties back to when I was saying, uh, when we ate out with me, Russ, and a couple other dudes, some, our waitress asked if there was a special event happening. I said the Special Olympics, because I'm fucking stupid. And, uh, she just kind of looked at me like I, I just killed her firstborn child or something. So. That was pretty cool. Gotta say. Right, so let's try this shit again. That not work very well. How did I do this the first time? Oh my god, I got hit by a technicality. Fuck you. Damn it. I'm, I'm not sure I can make it. God damn it. Hitting normies with degenerate hu- Yeah, I'm just an asshole. I have no social skills whatsoever. <laughs> just- I'm white, I can't do that. Mm. I'm just- I'm a smart guy, what can I say? And like, it really- it really had nothing to do with anything. Like, I just said that because I'm- like, usually in California, I'm the white dude who can't roll the R's. Like, when I- they make fun of me when I try to pronounce words in Spanish because they always they always try to teach me Spanish like I know uh, Lagartija which is lizard I think I know Chango and Changuito which means like monkey um, what else did they fucking tell me I don't even fucking know I know I know Cucaracha which is cockroach I, I call I call their dogs Cucaracha sometimes twitchy mo no that's fucked up some areas you can cheese. I like. I like. See, this is this kind of ties back to what I was saying. How everyone has like their own definition of cheese. I like how doing it without the items that make it easy. So basically, doing it the hard way is cheese in this particular circumstance. You just can never win. Oh shit! I need to go back anyways. I don't know why I'm going here. Is that top? I mean, I have so many awkward fucking moments that it's, it's hard to make a comprehensive list. But I don't think the dude, the waiter, actually took offense. He was just, he, he just was curious as to why I used that as a non sequitur. He said, why, why, why the fuck would you say it? Like, what does that actually have to do with rolling your R's, you idiot? Then everyone in the restaurant clapped and the whole bus stood up. Yeah, yeah, see, you know what happened. You were there. I don't- I'm not gonna listen to you, Jay. You're- you're a- you're a little puta. The hobo in the wallet store? That one was pretty dope, though. That was accidentally alpha. Diablo means fighting chicken. 
The bus driver clapped and crashed the bus, killing everyone on it. That's kind of morbid. Total alpha. All right, check this shit out. Check this shit out. I'll, I'll hit you with the story since if, if you if you had two brain cells and you've heard this story before, you know that this was an alpha moment. It, it was like a half alpha. It was like it was a beta alpha moment. It was like this weird fucking combination of the two. All right, so. When I worked as a security guard, yeah, I used to work as a security guard, believe it or not. That's what I did before Twitch. Um, I worked in a ghetto, a Metro PCS store in the fucking ghetto. And to get to the parking lot after we closed at like 10 p.m. or whatever the fuck, we'd have to walk through like a, like this dark ass alley that was scary as fuck. Um, it, it, it was quite frightening. And... I got approached by this uh, African American gentleman, who. Oh god, how do I even describe this? He, he was a scary looking motherfucker. He had like face tattoos and shit. And he comes up to me and he's like, "Yo, dog." Well, he didn't actually say dog. That's this. What that's that's what the language centers in my brain here. But he didn't say that. He's like, "Okay, hey man, I just got out of prison for like the third time." And, you know, real good icebreaker, I gotta say. And he, he's, I already know he's gonna start... If a homeless person approaches you, they want money. There's no exceptions, no matter what. And so I'm like, okay, what's he gonna say? And he's like, I'm born again Christian, yada, yada, yada. I need some more money to, you know, blah, 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 blah. And I, at this point, I'm used to being a poor motherfucker who has no money. So I, ju I just started security. I, I'm a baby dick security guard. I, I haven't even got... I think I just got my first paycheck. And so what happens is I'm like, oh, no, dude, I don't have fucking money because I think I don't. In my mind, I'm still broke as shit. You know, I just got my first paycheck. You know what I do? To show him that I have no money, I pull out my wallet and show him uh, the lack of money. Except I had just gotten paid and I, I got it in cash. So I had several hundred dollars in my wallet. So basically this, like, homeless dude who just got out of prison like, yo, dog, yes, I'm like, no, I don't got shit, and show him, like, hundreds of fucking dollars. And instead of being, like, sorry, or whatever the fuck, I'm just like, oh, shit, I fucked up, I'm gonna go to my car now, and I just kind of just waddled away. So, tell me that's not alfalfa. Like, I'm so alpha, this several hundred dollars ain't even shit. Fuck you. The only reason I didn't get shot is because I was a security guard. That's the only reason I did not get shot that night. That was mean? Well, it wasn't intentional, though. Like, I really thought I had no fucking money. Like, I really wasn't trying to be a dick, believe it or not. Oh, okay. Damn, that's rough. Were you in uniform? Yeah. Yeah, I was. It, it was at the end of my shift, remember? I, I said that I was walking back to my car, so I just got off work. So I, I'm, I'm convinced that I probably would have gotten my ass mugged if I had not been the security guard that night. I have the dash badge? I think I do. Let me see. I think I remembers that. Probably not. He probably didn't give a shit. Okay. I have this one, I think, yeah. I guess there's nothing to fucking kill for Soul Catcher in this level, so I should use this. I don't think that's gonna help for this, but you never know. He's looking for you. Well, I never leave the house, so it'll be, it'll be fine. Holy shit. Bump into him again. Well, I look very different now. Back then, I was security, so I had to have, like, really short hair, completely clean-shaven. Now I also look like I'm homeless, so he'd think I was, uh... One of his fellow kin. He wouldn't even ask me. Huh? When I reached my wallet... I remembered it was payday, so instead of unzipping it, play on my wallet, you know, awkward as fuck, chest scratch. No, you gotta go all the way. You gotta go all the way. You look like a bitch. These guys have a deceptive 
long range. How much time has passed between that incident? It's been like four years now, maybe? It's been a long fucking time. Three or four years, I would say. What's going on, Bino Chocolate? Currently an avid Tolo viewer? That would be weird. I don't know why he'd watch me. Like, I don't know why he'd be like, yeah, dude, I'm gonna do something. Uh, I'm, I'm gonna be respectable and watch a retard on the internet. Like, to me out. The only, the only people who watch me, watch me ironically. They're like, yeah, this guy's a fucking asshole and I hate him. Let's see, they, they get their friends, they huddle around. They, Let's listen to what stupid shit comes out of this in Brett's mouth tonight. So I guess he'd, uh, I guess he'd get his... His, his just desserts, he'd, he'd end up getting justice. Thank you for putting Carlos PSP2 in the cup shed. That's an interesting person to pick. Thank you, Todd Howard FBI. I'm sure he's gonna love it. Okay. Hmm. Here for the dog picture, respectable. Let's try this again. Let's bring the criminals to justice. Good man. Good man. Always, you can always trust Todd Howard FBI. We're actually here for Sith. What the fuck, your friends? First thing I do when I get off work is open your stream. Me and my friends are okay, but but what's worse? What re in reality? What's worse, being me or actually like huddling around a phone with like several other dudes? I know what I'd pick. All right, well I actually did that pretty much fucking perfectly. That's fucked up that my ghost spawned in the final room though. Try this again. Blame for being too humble. Mm, I've been blamed for a lot of things. I'm sure it's happened at some point. Like literally, think of it goddamn near anything, and it's been said to me at some point or another. I'm enjoying Hollow Knight. I like it a lot. It's fun. What's what's over here? Do I need this bird for platforming purposes? This is not a bird. There are no birds in Hollow Knight. At least not yet. Called a homophone octopus once or twice. Blame for global warming. Yup. I kind of can just ignore the bug. Okay, wow, your recharge time is quite slow. Or fast. Fuck this thing! Add all in. Christ, those things are fucking rough. Huh? Who the fuck shares their porn? I've shared porn before. Mm -mm. Oh no. What the fuck is this? Cursed are those who turn against the king. Okay. Is a ghost gonna pop out? You have a range attack? Fuck the range attack. I need my beetle juice. What's this? Mona Mon the Teacher, Lurian the Watcher, Hera the Beast. 
What's good, Sheena? About to get high as fuck. Puff, puff, pass. Crystal fucking weed. Dreamer locations added to map. All right. I guess that's my main objective. Because these are the same masks that are on the, uh, like, the, the big black egg. Towards the surface. Because I remember, because I, I, I distinctly remember the six-eyed one and the one with the little cute eyebrows. Oh, she's a jellyfish. Okay. Like, I, I'm gonna be honest. If you haven't shown your friends uh, an image of a dude fucking an a, a CG dinosaur, like, are you really friends? What the fuck? Like a weird-ass moth. Not, but speak for yourself, Beepus. Just because you think it's me, maybe I think heterosexual porn is is mean porn. You don't fucking know. You don't get to decide what is and isn't mean porn. Apparently, I'm dropping frames, so my internet's shitting right now. Sorry. It, it should be fixed in a couple minutes. Let me see. Is it still bad? I wonder if there's anything I can miss here. Still bad? Alright. There's not a whole lot I can do, unfortunately. This place is weird. Tomorrow's the Gundam stream, yes sir. Person watching started dropping frames. Taking the dream nail. Hold Y to charge and slash with the nail. Cut through the veil between dreams and. Okay, so I got a charge attack. Cool. Gundam stream? Yeah, we're gonna be building Gundam models tomorrow. Memoir. I don't like the way this lady's talking to me. Okay. What's good, Kazatov? Tomorrow isn't Friday. Tomorrow isn't this time tomorrow. Okay, okay, okay. Calm down. Alright, so I, I got a charge attack, and I'm, I don't know where the fuck I am now. I wonder if this... Is this the essence shit that she was talking about? So I gotta find those plants and gather the essence. Oh, I fucked that up. I keep the rhythm going in case it's timed. Um? Is that it? Story about JP. Oh boy. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. I think there's still more because of this little background effect. I don't see any reason why this should still be here. 
Oh, yep. There's one up here. Two up here. Okay, I don't hit them. I have to actually physically touch them. That makes more sense. Okay, so I guess these give 20 each. Gotta find five of these trees and come back. But what the fuck is this? This is like a... Some sort of door I can open, but I don't know how yet. Oh, and I missed the map for this area. God damn it. Oh. Oh, God. I only know where one of those little trees are. Okay, I'm gonna explore this new area. I'm, I'm at the point where there are too many things to explore. I have no fucking clue where I should be going, but I just got the dream down. I'm pretty sure that's important. It's been a while since I fought a boss, though. Leg pop? No, I just, I just had to move my leg because it's in a weird position. I sit, I sit like a Native American a lot of the time. I have my legs crossed and do all sorts of yoga poses. Do alcohol and tequila together? It's an, uh, interesting. Does not surprise me. Wanna know what the dream nail does? No, I'm good. Okay. What the fuck is this guy? Zero. Oh boy. For, for heals here. Oh, that return. Is this the only attack he has? Oh man, okay. This is basically... So you're not healing, fight. Oh, now he has four, okay. <laughs> yeah. So I just, I, I have to do this without taking hits, because I'm never going to get to heal. Alright. Wait. Oh man, I don't have a map. It's going to be annoying to traverse this area. No, no, no. Has anyone played Skyrim? Skyrim is my favorite game of all time. Hold on, I gotta blow my nose. Give me a sec. Alright, alright. So I guess I got him to approximately half a dwarf, and I guess he gets four swords. This isn't where I was. Where the, where the fuck did I go to get to where I was? Actually, what is this? Dream Shield. What is that? That follows the bear and attempts to protect them. Interesting. Oh, wait, what the fuck? I do have this. Hold on, I need to get rid of these things. That sounds dope. Okay, get rid of Dash Master and the little thorn thing to get greatly increased range of attacks. I think that sounds preferable to me, personally. Now I hear an Anna's typing, and no, fuck you, don't get rid of Dash Master. Okay. You should, I, I don't want to, because this controller has a dog shit R2 button. I, I know that sounds like a, a meme excuse, but I, it really is fucking bad. Fuck you. Wow. Alright. I 
can see the angle there. Yep. No. Okay. I see he interrupted and I lost too much Beetlejuice. I need to pay more attention to that. No, no cocoa butter. No cocoa butter. Dash like really far away to be able to dodge those. Okay. Interesting. I miss my cocoa butter kisses. Frames are better when you turn on Skyrim. Frames are still shit. What's going on, Fed and the Greg? Okay, that was interesting. Ow. It's a Breedus pair, and I guess so. That was an interesting fight. It's like... It's like a rhythm fight, almost. At least that's what it felt like. I wish you started with four swords instead of two. I like the four swords more than the two. I always imagine the script the voice actors have in front of them for recording gibberish. You can't just call it gibberish. That's fucked up. A lot of the dream nail fights are fantastic. Dream male fights, huh? Okay, so I gotta find my way out of this mess. Maybe I could read this inscription again and see something. Like maybe something's changed. No. Just checking. Through all this again. Thought. Alrighty. Paulo decided he wants to be really cuddly. Then why are you on Twitch and not cuddling your dog? That's fucked up. Okay. Can I crave for cocoa butter? I don't even know what cocoa butter is. I just I just paired stupid shit because I'm a I'm a drone. This is what it sounded like he was saying. This, I'm sure I get like a power up for this at some point, but I I don't know. Literally an all chocolate, gotcha. No, I know it's a real thing. I just don't know what it's used for, or whatever, what it's found in. That's what I meant. Imagine cocaine, but spreadable. Turns out I can hear both. No, you can't. There's only there's only Laurel. I didn't believe the gang stalking was real until this Yanny Laurel thing. Now I now I wholeheartedly believe that it is 100% real and I'm being gang stalked by people on the internet. Uh, white chocolate? I hate white chocolate. White chocolate's fucking disgusting. I cannot stand that. So meme has slipped under my radar. It's like the the dress, like the yellow, yellow and white and blue and black dress, except for, except for audio, where some people hear Laurel and, and some people pretend they hear Yanny. Not 100? Do I have 100? Did I get 100 from that, or did I get 80 from that fucking thing? 
I wasn't even paying attention to what I got from that. Oh, yeah, okay. Oh, I didn't even know. Holy shit, I need to pay more attention. Oh, that was a worthless reward. Alright, so I guess the idea is that... Anana said nail bosses, so I'm guessing you can fight optional bosses with the dream nail somehow. And they give you essence and you go and get various rewards, which I assume will get better and better. Uh, as you get more essence. Yanny? Yanny's not even a real word! What the fuck? It probably is, but I don't know what it means. I've never heard that word in my life. What's good, Newt Newt? It's a shit normie meme. No, it's gang stalking, Garrett Blackjack. Is it Beetle Train? Oh, is that? My grandma's name is Yanny. I don't believe you. Cohen said how Laurel gets picked up on audio recordings. Alright, so I, I just wanted to go to the Crystal Caves and and fuck shit up. Now I'm all the way over here doing Dream Nail nonsense. And I have no idea how my life has spiraled out of control like this. Alright. Master Yanny play the flu? No, I can't say I have. Legs look so weird. That's kind of sad. Um, I guess dirt mouth. Why not? I want to go back to the crystal, the crystal cave. I'm sure there's going to be something that prevents me from progressing through the Crystal Cave, but... See an email from Valve stating that Hoonipop violates rules and gallows for pornographic content. I assume we removed from the store unless the game is updated to said content. Valve is such a fucked up company at this point. Their quality control is utterly non-existent. Like, when Dark Souls 2 is allowed on, on Steam, that's when you know that the green light's taken over. Utterly reprehensible practices. Uh, okay, come here, buddy. You wanna kissy? I should probably get rid of Dash Master and get the increased uh, range. It suits my playstyle better. Competitive fan service. Don't say that because someone's gonna get mad at you for saying for daring to suggest that the game has fan service. Like when I when I was talking about Neptunia, and I'm like, that game panders sexually and has fan service. And no no. Neptunia? It's all about the gameplay. Like, it's not played by a bunch of anime loving degenerates who like seeing panty shots. It, it it's for that high quality, uh, riveting fucking gameplay and dialogue and storyline. I personally love the character interactions, like when that little girl gets suffocated by the pair of giant titties. That's not, that's not pandering, this is part of the plot. I think they take that I love the plot thing seriously. Ultimate Showdown? I remember that song. I used to be able to sing all of uh, Ultimate Showdown of Ultimate Destiny. I remember I sang it for some girls at church camp and they were very impressed. Remember I felt like a hot shot because, uh, our, our 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 church had like a people don't get triggered. This was not me doing this, but groups of girls were not allowed to leave without uh, at least one male. So even if you had three girls, they had to have one dude out there to like protect them or whatever the fuck for some dumb fucking reason. It was really stupid, but a group of of three ladies for whatever reason decided to take me along to like snow cones or whatever the fuck. And I sang that stupid song because I didn't know how to interact with women. So I just sang a retarded song from the internet and they thought it was funny. So. 
And then they ended up making it to where you couldn't have a one guy, one girl group because uh, kids would go on slushy dates and that violated uh, the precepts of the Bible or some shit. It was stupid. Church camp was weird. I made a TOS? Hell yeah, dude. Slushy dates. And probably the most... Don't, don't get me wrong. I, I'm going to preface what I'm about to say with me telling you that I've never been someone that's been particularly wanted by, by, by the ladies. I've always been like a lanky, ugly fucking retard. That, that's me. You know, you've seen my pictures. Uh, and thank you for the eight-month resub, Miss Doodles. I appreciate it. Thank you very much. So, all right. One, I, I went to church camp, I think, three years in a row. And the one I went to when I was 16, I had, like, fucking three chicks in one of my nuts. I swear to God, I'm not memeing, dude. I know no one's going to believe me, but I, I, had a, I had three. There was two Rachels and a Kayla, who... Uh, I'm pretty sure one wanted, wanted to, uh, have a little bit of the, the Tolomeo hand-holding experience. So, the first one was this chick who would always come and play Super Smash Brothers, but only when I was playing. She'd always want to be on my team and shit, and it, it was kind of cute. And I'm like, oh yeah, this is kind of dope, I like this. And then, and then... Uh, the Kayla, who I had known for years prior to that, apparently... I know for a fact she liked me, because she, she straight up told me at one point, and I told her, nah, lol, I'm playing World of Warcraft. She got fucking jelly because, uh, uh, Rachel number one would come over and play fucking Smash Brothers with me. And then, there were two competitions that I entered in church camp, and coincidentally, I won both of them because I'm a fucking legend. Uh, number one was the Super Smash Brothers. Obligatory. They were a bunch of fucking normies. I decimated them. I would I would skip dinner to play Smash Brothers. Uh, I would pick Meta Knight, and no one stood a chance, dude. I would just Meta Knight uh, in their ass, in their ass. So the second one was the crazy hair competition, and I got Rachel number one to give me like pigtails and shit. Cause I had like shoulder length hair, and I have really fucking like wavy. Uh, shaggy hair, as you've seen on Twitter. And I, I, I went up there with, like, fucking pigtails and shit. And, uh, this will give you an idea, actually, of how, how interesting the church dynamics were. So, a lot of the dudes did not like me. I was not particularly popular with the, with the dude folk. So, what happened was, I was winning the crazy hair competition... Until the final round. Until the final round. You get, guess what my opponent had? I beat a chick that had a hamster ball in her hair with my pigtails. But guess who the second finalist was that was not me? I had fucked up wavy 80s pigtails. Can you guess what the other person was rocking? It was it was a black kid who had, ha who had nothing done to his hair whatsoever. It... it Nothing at all. He just entered and did nothing for his hair whatsoever. Not a single thing. And everyone was voting for him in part because it was a meme and in part because they wanted me to lose. But I ended up winning. Uh, we, we did it by cheer volume. And, and fucking Rachel and Kayla were like, Oh yeah, oh my god, Tolomeo! <coughs> and so so I barely fucking won against, uh, against the... The black dude with nothing done to his hair whatsoever. He, he was a fearsome opponent, but I managed to squeak out a victory. And the victory uh, prize was a free, like a coupon for a fleet, a free slushie. And so, at church, at church camp, you had this fucking thing that everyone had to do at the very beginning, where you would put like a little envelope with your name on it, put it on the wall, and people would have to, would write you like notes and shit, of like encouragement, like prayer verses, or like gossip, or whatever the fuck. And I would receive like no mail whatsoever. I wouldn't receive shit. 
and except for when I won that free slushy. Then Rachel too was like, oh, I'm happy you won that. Um, I hope you enjoy your slushy winky face. And I'm pretty sure she wanted me to go uh, take her on a fucking slushy date. But I remember uh, that Rachel because she was really shy. And one time we were eating Cece's pizza and she smiled at me when I looked at her. And she had like a fucking pepperoni in her teeth. And I was like, oh, oh. I didn't say anything. I just let her have that pepperoni in her tooth. Um, and that, that's, that's all I really knew about that Rachel. But I'm pretty sure she wanted to bang. I'm pretty sure she wanted to fuck. And so you know what I did? You might be thinking, okay, it's a low meal. Now, which one did you bang? <laughs> Dog, I played Super Smash Brothers for the rest of the fucking duration of church camp. I didn't follow up with any of them. I didn't give a fuck. I played Meta Knight and I fucking dominated kids. I played so much Super Smash Brothers over the course of church camp that they actually staged an intervention on me during dinner because they figured out I wasn't fucking eating. Uh, and I was skipping dinner to play more Smash Brothers. So... Fuck it, dude. What are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? Oh, what the fuck? Oh, no. I... Oh no. Okay, that wasn't very polite. Oh my god, those jumps! Those predictions! Alright, I thought he was gonna jump away or like do the laser. Every time I expected him to do something, he did the opposite. Okay, hopefully this time I can get in there with full health. I was not ready for that. Outplayed. Yeah, I got fucked, dude. He was always one step ahead of me for sure. Caught. What kind of earplugs do you need to block that? HG. See, that was my church camp story. I hope you liked it. And. The, the last time I went to church camp, none of that cool shit happened. It was just everyone hated me. I was really sad. I didn't, I didn't have anyone asking to go on slushy dates or saying that they liked me. It was just fucking regular old Tolomeo. But I felt like a god for that 16th one. I, I, and I remember because you know what I did? I actually... I, I liked Rachel number one. But I, I didn't really follow up on it. You know what I did when I got back? I, I remember distinctly, I was super excited because in RuneScape, I had just hit 80 Slayer, but I had to go to church camp, so I, I couldn't kill Necreals and get my Rune Boots, which, this was before Dragon Boots were a thing. Um, and so I was like, dude, I'm gonna kill them, I get Rune Boots, those shits are fucking expensive now, I'm gonna make money, be on my way to Abyssal Demons. And so I went home and killed Necreals for like 10 hours. It was fucking dull, dude. Wouldn't have had it any other way. Ouchie. Also, my my uh, my sister found an old picture of me and showed me today where we went to a Renaissance fair and I was dressed up as a wizard. And uh, it, it, it kind of made me chuckle. The more things change, the more they stay the same. You were a nerd? Well, my parents were the ones who wanted to go to the Renaissance Fair. They really liked it for some reason. I didn't give a shit. I thought they were boring, personally. Ouchie. Nothing I could do! Stand here roaring. Oh, dude, the pushback is fucking me so hard right now. Shit. 
God damn it. I need to just stop trying to heal. It's always ending in disaster at this point. Wait, what the fuck hit me there? Interesting. Okay. This guy is... The hardest part is having your melee knock you back into the lasers. That happened twice. That's what got me to low health to begin with. Is I'm like, okay, well, I'm just gonna... I'm gonna melee him while he's vulnerable. And then I guess I should stop that because if he stuns the laser behind me, it pushes me back into it. And you, pretty much the only time it seems safe to heal is if you if you heal like as soon as he starts the war, basically. Oh shit! It's fucking hood rat miners. Boss is fun. I feel like this boss is hysterically easy, but I'm just stupid. Hey, thank you for the four-month resub, Twiggy Nose. I have a Twiggy Nose, too, dude. Thank you very much. Oh, man. We still got a ways to go. The competition is fierce. get hit there no matter what happens. Cause I'm fucking stupid. Okay. DSP body pillow. Jesus Christ, how horrifying. That's a cursed thought. Ban SCP? But... But I like that game. Oh. Okay, that was unfortunate. lasers. Dude, holy shit, these reeds. I always think they're gonna come out a little, a little later than they actually do. Oh, he just he he he, he dipped. He just said fuck you. Game has input reading. Interesting. Hey, thank you for the three month resub, Shrin Wet. Shrin Wet. I appreciate it, dog. Thank you very much. How are you? Hmm. Wait. What are you talking about, Dongo? Doing well, good shit. Glad to hear it. No longer takes away emotes. They never actively took away emotes. The way it used to work is you'd lose slots, but they wouldn't actively take your emotes away. But if you were to, like, remove an emote when you'd fall under the right number of subs, you would lose it. Shit. Need to go over there. That boss was interesting. Switch charms? No. Can I 3D print Sif? Nope. It's apparent on later bosses. Mm, shit. Excuse me. Being disgusting. I'm burp burping. God damn. Too much diet coke, I'm all gassy now. Okay. Hmm. 
What about the rat? Can I 3D print your rat? Sure. That's what you want to do? Hmm. I wonder where I should go now. Actually, let me look at the big overall map if I can. Alright, so City of Tears. I think that's the Fog Valley. I don't have the map for it, but that's, I think that's where the little alien is with the jellyfish people. Um, so I have to find the three keepers. I guess that's my goal. I'll do the one in Deep Nest last. Fuck Deep Nest. I don't know why he keeps calling me a churro. Oh, I need to remember I have this dream nail shit, too. I wonder if I can do anything sexy with it. I think I can get up there, but not right now. Not a weapon? That's fucking lame. It, it would be too slow anyways, though. Oh dear. Don't even understand subbing in general. How do you mean? Smack a thing with it? Oh god. This poor little bug. I want to hit this thing with it. Pain. So, does it read the thoughts of the enemies you hit with it? Deep nest. I've been there. It's it's kind of scary. We were there last night for a little bit. I saw the main attraction, but I didn't get too far. Hey, little buggy. Give me a kiss. I sub so the streamer likes me more than people who don't sub. Is that how it works? It's one of one of my favorite people in the stream has always been Shinoli, and he's uh, he's not a sub. What's going on for demo? Shin been around? I've seen him here and there. He's not... He doesn't come frequently, but he pops in every now and again. Probably just got better shit to do. People move on and end up having to, uh... Do shit outside of Twitch.television. Last thoughts in its last moment alive. Interesting. Hello, Splat. Oh, God. He's a big beetle. Oh, what's good, Logan? David streamers know I love them whether I sub them or not. The only way you can show love is to give people money. Don't you fucking know that, Dongo? That when people give bits, it's how much they love you. Pretty sure that's how it works. I've been to some streams, that seems to be how it works. What's good, Jessel? Oh god. I'm, I'm pretty sure that was some yikers shit. You can love your friends. Yeah, I, I love Russ Money. I love uh, Mr. Cryotoe. Love uh, Braddock. What can make you dance? Chihuahua. What the fuck? Give me some of this. If someone's homeless, they're incapable of love? Yeah, pretty much. The 
If the Mr. Rogers... God, maybe if Mr. Rogers was on meth and gargled marbles. What the fuck? Is this Kells? It's pulsating. Crystal heart. Hold left trigger on the ground, clean to the water, concentrate the force. Okay, that, that seems pretty good. Night, Shovey. Oh my god! Yeah, it's gonna make some of the platforming sections a little bit easier, I feel. Just a little bit. <laughs> God damn! And it lets you stop on a wall, too. That's so nice. Yes, Pearl, thank you for the 10 bits. When do you get rocket boots? Like five seconds ago. I, uh, I saw. A gigantic beast, which I will dub Kells, that was pulsating in anticipation of me removing something from it. I got the crystal heart. Chop. So that's really nice. It doesn't work on the conveyor belt. Figured I'd try just to see. Oh, I've been here before. Need to get out of this hellhole. Turn on my ad block for you. Wow. Don't you know that turning on ad block is literally stealing? Streaming is fine art. And patrons of Patreon are like the patrons of the old school fine art. And ad block is like museum robbery. Don't you know? Hey, thanks for the 97 bits, JG. I appreciate it, homie. Thank you very much. Okay, actually, all right, all right. I have a, I have a pet peeve. Can I talk some shit about a particular group of people? I want to talk some shit. You know what really bothers my bottom? When someone, I, I guess from like Australia or the UK, pronounces YouTube as YouTube. Like, what the fuck? What the hell is a YouTube? I don't even know what that is. Do you mean YouTube? I don't know what a YouTube is. Shit. Bottom, bottom bothers the fuck out of me. Oh, dude, I've heard some people, some accents do that. Uh, I, I pop it. See, Papa Dap is a YouTuber. <laughs> ow. Oh, oh, ow. Okay. Know how to spell hemorrhoid? It's okay, Dong. We know you're special. It's okay. I think I need like a double jump for this shit. I think that's probably like the last uh, mobility upgrade. Jewel instead of dual. Yeah, it's pretty bad too. Say elixir instead of elixir. So shut the fuck. Pop it up. Go back to YouTube comments. It's where you belong. Like, why? Why does this bother you so much? Like. Are you, I, I can tell I hit a nerve. Pop off his head, maybe. It's probably a good idea. I guess I could try it. Hey, buddy. Where is this fucking asshole? Maybe I'll come back. It's all good. 
Yeah, yeah, someone needs their fairy bread. They're having, uh, I'm gonna meltdown. People, people said that nobody uses trigger fish anymore. Look at Pop It App right now. Look at, look at those trigger fish. That, that, that's how you know you're a success. Wi-Fi the English way? Is it a Wi-Fi? I would laugh if someone called it Wi-Fi here, honestly. Super boost upward, can you? I don't think so. See, I don't know how to get to this pulsating uh, neg hole, though. Maybe there's a hidden wall or some shit. Right, I'm, I'm gonna eat out of here. Also, what's going on, Kawhi Daz? Pop it up. I don't know what the fuck that meme is. And yeah, Jezel, my my mom does not pronounce H. She says huge like Trump does. It's kind of funny. I think it's a New York thing, honestly. Good, how are you? I'm chilling. Just doing drugs. Alright. Okay, can I stop? God. God fuck. Okay. I wasn't ready for that. No, it's not Yanny. Shut up! That's fuck. Okay. There's like a delay when I land before I can jump, I guess. It's weird. Huh? Heard you any? No, you didn't. You're just memeing, bro. <laughs> Alright, let's see where this takes me. Is it I'm pretty sure this is going to take me right to Dirt Mouth or whatever the shit it's called. Yup. Can I go in here yet? Oh shit, I can. Yes. Can I become a three month sub? I don't know. Maybe you got cucked at some point, Spilal. Also, what's good, dude? Really? What the fuck uh, is this uh, thing? I'm GG. Okay. What's good, Frodo Baggin? Oh, it's a confessor. Interesting. I've been streaming for how long? About three hours. Alright, so I just fucked myself there. Wait. No, okay, so I guess he's not a boss fight. I, I was kind of half expecting him to start kicking my ass like Yorick from fucking League of Legends summoning like 70 ghosts and beating the shit out of me. I don't know if I'm surprised or disappointed. Okay, so... Part of me wants to go all the way to the green path now, because there's something I want to try. Hey, thanks for the bits, SCP. Fuck you, too. The schedule, kind of. I kind of just start whenever the fuck I feel like it lately. Okay. Oh, no, this isn't the bat lady. Ugh. I have to sleep soon. I gotta wake up so that I'm here for the uh, fish delivery <sighs> tomorrow. I don't, I don't want them to get here early and then I'm fucking sleeping and they're sitting there marinating in the sunlight. Okay. Quite a few dream bosses, but you're pretty underleveled for that. You 
plan to finish this game. Yeah, I don't see why not. Okay. What's good, Scoop? Man, don't, don't tell me where shit is. Calm down, dogs. If you tell me to go somewhere, I'm gonna ignore it and do it later. Let me, let me, let me do it on my own, please. Any some hot Cheeto sushi? Nah. This isn't the way to green path. Storming. I wish it was storming here right now. I like the rain a lot. Okay, so let's kill these nasty bugs. Hold on. I actually want to check something really quick. Give me a moment. Do all things to progress the game or work towards completion in any way? No. Right. Hmm. How many of these grubs? Do oh man, the background counts too. Holy shit. It's a fiesta. Look at all these happy worms. Oh, look, he's throwing money at me. Throw that in my G-string, baby. Oh, what the fuck is this? Wait, he reminds me of the polar bears from Banjo-Kazooie. They make the same noises. Grub song, huh? Oh, where's more? I should go buy stuff at the, uh, town, actually. I got a lot of cash money records now. Okay. I got so much fucking money. God damn. Feel like I'm, I'm streaming IRL right now. Jesus. And then I have, like, the ability for text-to-speech donations. And that, that grub just tweeted a lot of racist shit, but I got paid. What's good most average? Autobiography? Dude, I'm like the most boring person in existence. Literally no one would give a fuck. Like, I know you're memeing, but like... You would have to be a, uh... An interesting person to want to see my autobiography. Just give me an extra health? It does. Nice. Okay. Right, I want keys. Keys seem like they're really important. Okay, Sprint Master. I could buy the rancid egg. Comprehensive history of Tolomeo. It'd be like one episode, it'd be five minutes long. Find a place to get your charm sockets? I don't think so. Who's autobiography? Well, I'm listening to fucking CWC's comprehensive history. Hello, B Flip. Put on a certain notch. I think I'm good now. The I'm nobody arc. No, it's a saga, Nanas. Come on. Hey, thank you for the love of my resub, King Jezel. I appreciate it, dog. Thank you very much. It's been 11 months already since we fucking met. That's crazy to me. Like, just yesterday, you were laughing at me getting plowed by fucking bighorners. <laughs> okay. Any goodies up here? When we get to community Minecraft streams, probably never. That'd be weird. Community Minecraft streams. This is a community, and we are a family. Oh, okay. Um, see, originally we were kind of toying around with the idea of, and whenever the new CWC Comprehensive History, we all watched it in like a movie night in Discord, but I don't, he, he releases them somewhat inconsistently, so I don't know. Huh? 
Have you seen a movie night happen? Well, okay, let me tell you the story of movie nights in our Discord. When we first made it, I one of my real life friends had always wanted like someone in our group of friends to get like a, a, a for lack of a better word, an audience of people. Like one of us becomes like a streamer or some shit. So he was super excited that people had wa started watching me, and he wanted. He was like, "Yo, dog, can we do like a movie night in Discord? It'd be really fun." Because he wanted to show people uh like all sorts of weird shit. They had the English dub of ghost stories. There's some like fuck I think we watched the first two minutes of Boku no Pico. So he, he was like thrilled. And I'm like, alright, let's do movie nights and shit. Um and so we did it and he we would do it like once a week, but very quickly um people had to like go and ruin a good thing and like other people who weren't uh, my friend would be like, okay, we need to do a movie night now. And it, it, it spiraled out of control really quickly to where, like, every fucking night someone was doing some movie night shit. And it, it really did not do well for, uh, keeping people interested in it, if that makes sense. So they, they ended up giving themselves too much of a good thing, I guess. They, they... By doing it too many times with too many different people, it, the novelty wore off. What a scary beast. Blame Swiss. I don't even know if Swiss is alive anymore. Last had a Stanley Kubrick movie night two weeks ago. We did the CWC documentary once too, like the original CWC documentary. Also, hello, Kazanorian. I need to get a refill soon. Very good. See, I have an idea. I don't know if it's going to work. It's something I've been wanting to do since I first came to the Green Path. How's the carrot diet doing? Well, today I ate a salad of spinach, carrots, and mushrooms. Uh, it was disgusting. So, I mean, I'm I'm consistently eating the healthy shit, but my biggest problem is it's not filling at all. I don't understand how people live off of vegetables. Like, I swear to God I could eat, like, the entire bag and it would not make me full. What time are you doing the Gundam stream? Um, probably normal time. 10, 11, my time. It, if Cry wants to do something, then probably like 11 is when they usually end, and if not, then I'll start my normal time at 10. What's going on, Dragon Wrecker? I've been playing Vigi games, dude. How are you? How sick? She's sleeping. She's good, though. She stole another one of the other dog's toys today. She, she is the queen of thieves. God damn it! The delay after you you land. I need to. I need to like mash jump. No, no, not this way. So is there nothing to it? Is there nothing over here? Interesting. Okay. Pickles or vegetable? You gotta come back later. Yeah, there's like a little thing under the uh, wall that looks like you can go under. I've seen that sort of shit before. I don't have whatever it takes to do that. Just gotta come back later. And then I, I remember there was another place I saw earlier with a bunch of spikes that you probably need the dash to get through if I had to warn, I guess. Christian, yeah, Julie! 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 Hmm. Yeah. I love CWC. Julie! Julie! 
No, no pickle ricks. No pickle ricks. I like the black dick outlines in this area. Yeah, they had a nice touch. The Valley of the BBC. Where gods fear to tread. Oh shit. Okay, hold on. Have I have not been down this way before. Normies want me to buy State of Decay. Say no. Ouchie. Do I want fast travel? Let's fuck fast travel. CWC watch Rick and Morty? Not even CWC is gonna watch Rick and Morty. I mean, come on. See, I'm the opposite better than him. I like fruits, but not vegetables. But vegetables are the healthy... The healthy shit. The good good. Not a big veggie fan. State of Decay, more like Plate of the Gay. That doesn't even make sense. Which system? Oh, uh, CWC had sex with the PS Triple. Chad Warden is rolling over in his grave as we speak. I miss Chad Warden, too. I miss the old internet. The new internet sucks. Like, the old internet, you had, like, CWC and Chad Warden. Now you have, like, fucking assholes like me. What a fucking farce. Hard to get good fruit these days. I like bananas. Bananas are my shit. Hi, Chris. Fuck a PS3. Power of, of sheer will. Fuck. Okay. Pineapple. Yeah, I love pineapple, too. Just not on pizza. If you get it on pizza, you're part of the problem of our, our society. Oh, God. So I'm, not, I'm not doing very good at this. God damn it. All right, I need to go kill shit. I have so much trouble with platforming in games. It's unreal. It's not have to kill things because I really don't want to have to respawn. Hello, Tremastics. What's good, dog? Ooh. And see, now I'm kind of disadvantaged because my weapon's been upgraded and now I can't get as much soul from enemies because I don't hit them as frequently. You an asshole or a dick? Both. Oh. School has great pizza? I don't believe you. I refuse to believe that great pizza has ever been conjured by anyone's mind before. That's like one of the stare too long into the abyss and it stares back into you ideas. Don't know shit about pizza. Alright, then tell me about pizza. I'm all ears, dude. Well, I guess I can't say that. I got a pretty big nose, so I guess I'm all ears and nose. Oh, what's good, Sniper Knight? How are you doing, dog? What do you think about great pizza, Sniper Knight? You heard that right. Great pizza. First, you love Hawaiian pizza. Part of the problem, Captain Crow. You're part of the problem. Oh shit. These fucking bugs, god damn it. Like sweet, super sweet sour on pizza. That's the thing, yeah. I don't like things that are just like a complete contradiction of flavor. Like, there's a there's a way pizza is supposed to taste in my mind, and adding something that's like the complete contrast to like the saucy taste of a pizza, like fruit, like like bananas or pineapple is just wrong. I love pineapple, but I would never put it on pizza. Did 
Think of your thighs. Interesting. Just think of the thighs. You don't want to be Thunder Thighs? That was my middle name in high school. Spicy things. Oh, I love spicy shit. I don't. I don't mind jalapenos on pizza personally. Holy shit! All right. What the fuck? See, I have a sneaking suspicion I'm not supposed to, like, dash over here. Yep. Oh, fuck. This is gonna be rough. Holy shit. Okay. That is a long sequence. So welcome to the next hour, fellow gamers. I feel like I should probably get the little mantis badge for this, the one that increases my range. It might make it easier to do the pogo shit. I wonder if it works that way. Yeah, you know what? I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna get that right now. No, not this. Also, what's the Grub Master do? Oh. Okay. Oh yeah, that's noticeable. So hopefully this will make it easier to bounce off of the, the big ass bogs. I also like the in increased range in general. This seems like it's very good for general combat. Yeah, that... It makes it so much easier to kill these dudes. I hate meat trio pizzas. I do too. I I just like jalapenos. I think spice and I, I don't know how you describe it, the taste of pizza, but whatever pizza is plus spicy is good to me. I like it. But fish. Oh, sorry, jalapenos. My bad. Jalapeno peppers. Is umami? Oh, shit. I didn't know my mom was pizza. I guess, I guess that makes sense. What's going on, Mestio? So I fucked that up. I overestimated my range. Dude, fuck. This is gonna be rough. What the fuck? <laughs> what the hell? Oh, there's more? Uh. Is it down there? What are these nasty eggs? Rancid eggs. So calm. Um. Didn't take as long as the centipede shit. Man, jail. Come. Why are you a detractor, jail? What the fuck? <laughs> I got. The game had mercy on me, though. 
He came had mercy. All right, all right. <laughs> Even this is like. <laughs> Nail art. Interesting. Hold X to concentrate energy into the nail. Release the button without holding up or down to perform the great slash. Okay. Gehwach. Yeah. All right. This seems really good, actually. I was worried it was going to be shit, because I'm like, oh, you're probably going to have to sit still to charge it. But no, this, I, as far as I can tell, this doesn't really impede your movement or anything. Can you? Yeah, you can even dash and shit. So it's literally just a... Okay. That's fucking amazing. So you're pinning on vegetarians, vegans? Um, I don't care what people do. Uh, if you want to be a vegetarian or a vegan, more power to you. Um, the thing is, even if you believe Dream Nail, you want me to Dream Nail that guy? Okay, let me go back. I just don't see a point in forcing your beliefs on others. You know what I mean? Like, I actually think it's a good thing to be a vegan. That might, that might make a couple people turn their heads, but I don't think there's a problem with saying, you know, I want to be environmentally conscious. In a, in a perfect world, we could all do that and also have good food to eat. Um, oh, I can cancel that. Okay. But when you start just trying to force your personal beliefs on others, it gets irritating. Okay. perfect world nobody would have to do it in a perfect world we could just grow lab meat that tastes perfectly fine although then again we're working towards that i'm pretty sure even if it tasted exactly the same people would be against it just because like the, for the same reason people are against gmos in general no fuck you it's not the same man what's going on valentine Nothing would die. Yeah, the fact that dogs die is probably the greatest crime in the universe. Environmentally conscious. Mm. Some of them are. The idea, the, the core idea of veganism is usually environmentally conscious. Whether or not the people who actually consider themselves vegans are environmentally conscious is subject for debate. Also super environmentally friendly too. People who don't grow up with it will be against it. People in 50 years will not give a shit. Yeah, yeah. I know my dad was all was really anti-GMO. It's not what God wanted. Hey, thanks for the 11 month resub, Blue Man 900. I appreciate it, dog. Thank you very much. Universe is about balance. Okay, fairy bread elemental. <laughs> Balance, you know what, you know what completely skews balance? Saying YouTube. Instead of YouTube. I'm pretty sure that's chaotic evil. I'm actually getting my Tolomeo Gold subscription. I remember the 4chan gold. One year, huh? Thank you very much. Elixor. What if I told you that the reason I pronounce it that way is just on the off chance that Elixir comes in here, that he hears that and gets upset? You know what's sad, too? Like, I love steak, but you know what I love more than steak? 
Okay, maybe not more than this. You know what I also love? I think cows are fucking amazing animals. I really like cows. Especially, like, nice little baby cows. They're cute as fuck. They taste so good. Chickens? I like chicks. I don't know if I like full-grown chickens. Although I saw a, uh, unrelated to chickens, but I guess similar type of animal. I saw, like, this video of some dude who knew, like, a geese. Or a geese. A goose. And he's like, oh, yo, what up? And the goose like, wah, wah, wah. And it, it, it went over to hug him, and I'm, it, I hate geese, but that kind of, that, that warmed my heart a little bit, I won't lie. We baby cows? Yeah, sometimes. Do I do a good goose impression, by the way? Geese? Yeah, yeah, no, I hate geese. Geese? I got, I got chased by a couple of those motherfuckers when I was a little kid. Yeah. The John Tron enemy. <laughs> Sitting on the sidewalk? You don't know. You haven't seen my room, Kazanorian. Gundam Stream might surprise you in more ways than one. Can I make that noise, people? Just yeah, because geese are scary, dude. That's not. It's not like you're doing the impression of an ice cream man or something. They're not gonna come flocking to you. What the fuck? Not environmentally friendly to be vegan as it takes. Well, that's not the only consideration. If that was the only consideration, too, or then maybe it, maybe you'd have a point. But you have to consider like the emissions of the cows and how uh, how much you have to feed the cows. Because you re you realize like to raise a cow, you have to feed it a fuck ton of crops, right? It, it's not like cows are just a. Uh, Completely self-sufficient. You have to put a lot of energy into a cow to get it to adulthood. So, my my two points, I guess, would be that you need crops to sustain a cow. So it's not you you would need uh, the land to grow the crops for the cow. And in addition to that, uh, you have to consider the cow's emissions as well. Like that's the main thing is they fart a lot. And they create a lot of greenhouse gases. Like, it sounds like a meme, but science behind it. My bugs? No, that's a valid point. Bugs, if you if you really want to get into like the absolute most efficient food source, bugs are fucking incredible. Uh, but that's disgusting. Thank you for the host, Duke. I appreciate it, dog. I don't ever want to eat fucking bugs. And I, this is coming from a kid who ate fire ants when I was a wee little bastard. Fifty cows? Think they have feed for them? Who the fuck wants to eat a roach? Well, I mean, if... If you had a situation where the roach was not allowed to eat, like, a bunch of dog shit... Like a roach normally would. Then maybe I'd be like, oh, okay, and that kind of makes sense. But I'm, I'm still with you. Just the idea of eating insects is not appealing to me. Lobsters are basically water roaches. That's true. That's true. They used to call them the roaches of the sea. They used to grind lobster shell and all into like a paste to feed prisoners. Uh, during the early days of the United States. Okay. Pro actual meat and that's yeah. But Okay. What the fuck is this? Where the hell am I? This looks scary. Howling Cliffs. Cliffs. Cliffy B. The stream bit has been alright. A chill, relaxed stream. Eat hot dogs? Yeah. 
I like hot dogs sometimes. Not for not from fucking Sonic though. Like hot dogs from Sonic or like I'm pretty sure that's one of the nastiest things I've ever eaten from a uh, fast food place. No giant fuck today. Nope. Only only medium sized fucks. Lobster. Yeah yeah. It's, so a big part of the insects thing is like they a lot of. A lot of things that we consider to be delicacies, delicacies or not, are our perceptions as like a society. Because, like, like I said, at one point, uh, rich people wouldn't be caught dead eating lobster. Although, to be fair, uh, it wasn't particularly appetizing when part of the lobster was also their exoskeleton. But maybe a hundred years from now people won't see eating bugs as like an inherently nasty thing. I know a lot of Asian countries eat bugs. And at least in some capacity. Okay. Hot dogs get old really fast. I know, I used to... Uh, when I was a teenager, my mom would cook me like frozen uh, french fries and like five fucking hot dogs for dinner a lot. I got very sick of hot dogs. Okay. Cow meat? I mean, it kind of, Kobe beef already is, if we want to get really into it. It's a boring fucking talk. Alright, Sniper Knight, then uh, change, the, change the topic. What would you like to discuss? Don't, don't be an asshole who's like, this is boring, and then not suggest an alternative when it comes to conversation. That's actually... One of the most draining things uh, is if you're trying to keep a conversation going with people and uh, being social to keep things going. Like, you want to go somewhere, for example. You're suggesting all these places, and you have one asshole who's, like, shooting every idea or, or discussion down, but not suggesting any alternatives. That shit is straight-up draining, dog. Don't be that guy. Fuck you, you stupid bug. We're eating you first. Later, Sinister Syndicate. Snappy tomato cicada pizza. What the fuck? Can we talk about why I don't have a GF? Sure, why, why don't you think you have a GF, chum? What's going on, Dick's out for Harambe? I'm alright, man. How are you? Talk about traps. There's really not much to discuss unless we're talking about beginners' traps in video games. Okay. Eh. Stop. Oh, not. You don't have to use pesticides. But it still, it still doesn't have anything to do with the emissions as well. Like I can, I can accept that as like, uh, like an all right sort of thing. You still have to grow the crops. Not using pesticides is a mitigating factor, I suppose, but that's... It doesn't completely, uh... You still need the space, you know? Like like you said, that a big part of it is the space needed. But I'll, I'll give you a point for the pesticides. It's, it's a fair point. Alright. Maybe you're gay? This joking didn't know that was gonna be something to get... No, I'm not mad. I'm just saying that, like, if you're gonna suggest something... Or if you're gonna suggest that something is boring, you need to you need to bring an alternative. If you wanna be polite. What's the worst shit you've eaten? Uh I really did not like my my first and uh, only experience at Korean barbecue. I thought it was extremely nasty and I did not like it whatsoever. That's a controversial one. That always gets people bottom bothered. I talk about K barbecue. Feel about dating a homie's ex? I I would be uncomfortable with that personally, but there's no. It, it just depends, I guess. On sushi, I like sushi a lot. But K barbecue. Maybe, maybe it was the place we went to, but I don't know, man. That experience was bad enough that I, I, I'm not really eager to try anymore. D 
deep nest? No, no, I don't think so. I fought, I got the dream nail and I fought the crystal boss. I fought the first dream nail boss and the crystal golem thing and that was, uh, that was all for boss progression today. Salt and vinegar. Yeah, I like salt and vinegar chips a lot. I don't mind vinegar. In fact, I, I like vinegar a lot. Am I beating? No, it's all good, dude. You're just asking a question. I, I want to avoid going to the deep hollow. <laughs> I, I, I don't... I like taking my time and exploring my first playthrough in this sort of game. And right now, I feel like... May maybe now that I have the nail upgrade, it would be different, but... I feel too rushed in that area right now. I don't enjoy it. Because, see, here I could just dawdle and be as slow as I want. And there's no real penalty. But there's a lot of parts of the the deep nest where rushing is highly encouraged. Where the fuck is this last one? Here we go. Indian food? I've actually never tried Indian food before. Being like Bayo? Yeah, this is, I, I'm not sure how people are liking it, but I've had fun with this game so far. Why I'm failing college? Because you're watching streams instead of studying. Majority of people love K barbecue? I don't know. I'm, I'm really picky with meat. I have very high standards. Shit. Curry isn't half as good as anime makes it look. <laughs> There's your fucking problem. You know, you know what you're doing. If you're if you're using anime as a judge for how good it, something's gonna taste, you're being DSP because DSP did a fucking review on cup noodles because he saw them and they looked delicious in Final Fantasy 15. <laughs> that is one of the most unbelievable series of events that I've ever seen take place in my life. Really good. Oh, good shit. Some people need to study more than others, though, Jezel. I... Personally, I, I'm, I'm not saying this to, uh... To be like, oh my god. Because, like, we, we all know... Let me, let me go ahead and establish... We all know I'm stupid. Like, we all know that I'm generally not the brightest, uh... The brightest knife in the tool shed! You know what I mean? Um, and, and that was intentional, by the way, just in case you were curious. I know you don't keep knives and tool sheds, usually. But, I'm someone who has, like, a good memory. It's a memory thing, right? So, I never really needed to study too much. Because I can retain information very easily. Um, some people don't have that blessing, though. And it, you can be very, very intelligent and have a lot of trouble with school because you don't retain information like that. Okay, so different people have varying levels of difficulty because the thing is when you have standardized tests, when most of the school systems in most countries are, are standardized tests, it's more of like rote repetition and memory than anything. Um, they don't teach you how to use critical thinking a lot of the time. It's a, it's a, it's a memorization game more than anything else. Okay. I am Gorb. Bow. Bow, bow, bow. Ascend with Gorb. Why does he make chicken noises? What the fuck? What is this? What is this? This sound design happening right now?
Okay, that one was easy. Oh! All right, what do you got to say? Hi, I'm Gorb. All right. Reminds me of the fucking dudes in Fallout 3 that uh, are just like... Don't they say like Dave or some shit? They're all named the same thing and they just say it over and over. Forget the specifics. Okay. It's a little bit too easy, but... Gary? It was Gary, right, right. You weren't high enough level? That thing only had one attack, though. Like, it, it wasn't particularly difficult. And it gave you room to heal, too. Like, that's the thing. Okay, I'm gonna take a break really quick. I need to go get a drink. I, I have not had tea this entire stream because it, it's been fermenting. So let me bring up the, the patented fish cam really quick. And... Why? What the fuck? So weird right now. Oh yeah, right, right, right. Hold on. I need, I need to remove it. Because I unplugged the fucking webcam. Give me a second. Sorry. Alright. Because I, I need I need some, some liquids. Okay. There we go. I'll be right back. So you can see Fat Princess. The big fucking blue fish in the middle is Fat Princess. If you look really, really closely, you can see the ghost catfish. They're in the top left corner of the tank. Uh, they're all transparent except for their heads. Fat Princess was just fucking with them, and they're schooling fish. So they're all together right now. There should be five of them. Um, they, they can be quite difficult to see, though, so...
Ah, I fucked up the thing. I would show you more of Sif, but I'm fucking naked right now. I can't have my body on, <laughs> on the fucking stream. I'll get my ass banned. All right, all right. So, see, you, you got some Sif. Just a little bit, but hopefully you liked it. Okay. Around the house, well, naked? Yeah, yeah, no one's home right now. When I, but when I say naked, I usually just mean in my box. Who's not like buck fucking naked? All right, hello dynamite. These emotes are all the same. Yup, yup. Look at all of them, just identical. Okay. Hello, Treek. Chi Tracobi. Oh God, I'm, I'm sorry. I butchered your name, and I butchered myself. Sif has little Grinch feet right now. I need to trim her paws. She's got like some Super Saiyan dog fluff going on. Like 80? I wish I had 87 emotes, dude. <laughs> like, can you imagine how much asinine shit I'd be able to fit in there? God damn, that would be that would be the life. Let Sif build the Gundam. Sif. Sif is uh. I just say she's eaten Gundam parts before. I have to be very careful that things do not fall to where she can bite them. She also likes to eat jigsaw puzzle parts. And when I say eat, I don't mean like actually swallow. I mean she... Oh, God. She just consumes them. Not consume. She chews them. That's what I meant to say. My bad. I can't talk. I, I don't know words. I'm sorry. What's going on, Lord Saturn? Why not? Ludwig, I mean, nothing changes. Like, you, you, you can't say that my topics of discussion have changed considerably since when I first started. I'm just, uh, wait. Am I holding up or down? Okay. Holy fuck. Bam. Binder. Interesting. It seems like it do it could do some big dick damage. I didn't use the, the uh, charge attack at all in the fight with the other thing, though. Hello, Pixel Sam. So, question: That boss was supposed to be like piss fucking easy, right? The one I just fought, the nail boss, the thing that just ejaculated spikes. Cause he was pissed fucking easy. Right. A lot of the dream bosses are easy, okay. That was the hardest boss. Can you imagine? <laughs> one attack! What the fuck is that duck emote? That's amazing. When did he get the duck emote? When the fuck did this happen? Oh my god. I fucking... I fucking love it, dude. That's amazing. Hey, can you guys do me a favor? Next time you see Russ, can you tell him how fucking awesome that emote is? He's been down. He thinks his emotes are uh, are bad. So, so give him some positive feedback on that one. Because that shit is fucking dope. 
What's good, Captain? Steal his ducky? No, no, that duck's amazing. Makes sense now. Because uh, he, he plays fucking duck games, so why wouldn't he have a ducky? But I'm surprised it took this long. Alright. You don't take. No, I don't want a duck. I just like the duck he has. Wait, where the fuck am I going? Dude. Okay. Jund has a duck as well. So is this all there is to this area for now? It doesn't seem like there's that much here. Totally get a duck. Oh, what's good, Russ? You're still here? Shit. I need to replace Basil with something, but I don't know what yet. I have no clue. I don't have the faintest fucking idea. Cause like I, I have ideas I guess, but I don't have the ability to realize them right now. Like I'm thinking it, a pissed off rat would be dope. Like an angry rat. Like a screaming angry rat would be kinda cool. Um but that's hard to make. Or a, a sleeping Sif would be dope, but I don't have any fucking pictures of her sleeping. Resident Sifter. Ducky mode is by this amazing artist. Oh, I know true. He comes in here every once in a while. I, I, I always fuck his name up no matter what. I cannot pronounce his name worth a shit. Basil's way better than Brud and Sanic. Don't you fucking say that. Say that to my face, motherfucker. Not online and see what happens. Put Sif in a duck costume. Mm. She has a. I have pictures of her in a lobster costume. Bra is trash. Nah, dude. Fuck you. You don't know what you're talking about. Okay. Livestock farming. Oh, absolutely no. That that's the thing. Like I. That's that's not even subject to, to debate. You want to know what? I, I I think save for insects. I could be wrong on this. Uh, I, I could be wrong on the specifics, but I think outside of like insects and shit, one of the most successful species in the entire history of the planet is the chicken. Um, because of how many chickens we fucking breed and how many are birthed because we farm them. So if we're if we're going to if we're going that route, then we, we made the chicken, like, the most fucking prolific species pretty much ever as far as birds are concerned, at the very least. And probably more than any mammal as well. Definitely more than us. Like, the average human eats, like, seven gorillion chickens over the course of their lifetime. Like, I'm pretty sure I've eaten well over several hundred chickens. And so I said outside of, like, insects and shit. Melon Fox, because you can't you can't compete with insects. Okay. Hate chickens. I like chickens. So that's why I don't think it's an inherently bad thing to like. I I eat meat. Um, but the thing is, I think there's a responsible way to go about uh having livestock like if you treat it humanely and make sure and don't like abuse your fucking livestock and and keep them in neglected conditions then i don't have a problem with it it's it, cows in particular are a big problem due to the nature of their emissions but like i think the one animal i just really don't like being in a captivity are pigs because pigs are really fucking smart and we treat pigs like dog shit um, like, pigs in captivity 
are treated fucking terribly. Not balanced, not one or the other. Yeah, yeah, but the thing is, we're too far in the into livestock right now. Our our current system is not very well sustainable. Good night, Wolfotic. Teacup pigs aren't teacup pigs a myth? Like I'm pretty sure all all pigs get to be of considerable size, and teacup pigs. I've heard that they are. Uh, that they're essentially neglected and they don't give them enough food because they they think they're supposed to go to like a maximum size of one inch or whatever the fuck. Pigs killed my family, so I do the same. Oh, it's good, Tybee. With turkeys? Turkeys are mean motherfuckers. Turkey jerky's good, though. What's Fury of the Fallen? Is this good? Oh, it's RTSR. Holy shit. Factory farming sucks. Yeah. If you if you do uh, livestock in a responsible manner where you're not putting fucking pigs into, like, cages barely big enough to hold them and that's how they live their entire lives, then I don't, I don't see anything wrong with, uh with eating meat, obviously. Okay. And one HP is a bitch. Yeah, it seems like more effort than it's worth at this point. All parrots are caught from the wild? I know that. It, it's, uh... Interesting, for lack of a better word, I suppose. That was a nice Sith noise. Hold on. Damn it! Why doesn't it crush me? That would have been that would have been comedy gold if I bounced off of that and then the elevator crushed my fucking stinky grapes. God damn it! I'm pissed that that doesn't kill you actually. If they were plotting to kill the town. Honestly, with how mean some of those big fucking birds are, it wouldn't surprise me. Like, if it was a gaggle of geese, then yeah, I'd believe that for sure. Okay. Um. See. Oh. I know what I want to do, but I don't know if I can do it yet. Because my thing right now is... I don't I don't want to talk about what I'm thinking right now because I don't want people to give me the answer. I want to find it for myself, so please, please don't tell me what the next uh, the next step is. But I'm, I'm going through in my mind where I could go. I guess I could go back to the City of Tears. I didn't fully explore that area. The City of Treats. Hi, you want me to spoil the entire game? Please don't. That was, like, the God of War spoilers were so fucking bad. It was crazy. Like, I think almost every single stream had at least one person trying to spoil, like, the... Not trying. They, they did spoil, but... Like, hey, this is how the end of the game goes. It's just like, oh. All right, Ben Nevada, take it easy. Thank you for the host, Mr. Bonders. What's good, dog? How are you? Hollow Knight? Yeah, I finally got around to playing this shit. I think I've only watched you and Parallax play a little bit of it. Um, I'm not too far in. The last boss we killed was this degenerate that just ejaculated spikes in a radial pattern. I think his name was Gorb. I like Flaming Hot Cheetos. No, I like Flaming Hot Cheetos. I just don't like fuck like Flaming Hot Cheetos and sushi. Like that's degeneracy. That's fucked up. Why would you ever do something like that? Socks on? No, I don't usually wear socks unless I'm going out. Like boneless sushi? Yeah, boneless sushi's a hype. 
A little metal breach. I guess I could fast travel. Not being funny when people spoil the game. No, no, I'm, we're talking about people, like, dropping, uh... 100% unmitigated, like, spoilers for the, the actual plot of the game. Like, this is what happens at the end of the game. This is the plot twist. Um, like, backseating is annoying, to be sure. But I can recognize that, for the most part, it's, uh... People are trying to be helpful. Oh, what's good, Hank? People came in with the wall text, but exactly, like shit like that. Like, here's every plot twist of the game. And they leave. It's like, come on. Well, you know, if that's if that's what makes them happy. Some people just the world would be simple if we all understood one another, but that's just not the case, huh? I'm looking for the- I know there's like a dream catcher thing around here somewhere, so that's what I'm looking for right now. Semi-diet- I- I ate a salad today. Um, I- I ate spinach, carrots, and mushrooms. It was fucking awful. I hated- Every single moment of it. Why? Alright, this is gonna sound like some super hippie shit, so bear with me. But, when you have a dog shit diet, that affects your health, and your health affects your general state of mind and well-being. Um, maybe, maybe it'll end up being a placebo thing, but I wanna eat better so that I'm healthier, and maybe I'll, like, more consistently be in a good mood and be, like, someone worth a fuck. Like, you know what I mean? Fuck. I should have just zapped off. I, I think it's especially important considering that my, my, uh, my thing right now is streaming where a big part of it is how personable... Um, how, how good I am in interacting with other people, how good of a mood I'm in. Uh, so maybe it'll help. I don't know. We'll see. I'm doing my own experiment. Maybe I won't notice any difference and I'll go back to my old ways, which is probably what's going to happen. But, you never know. Well-being can suck a dick. Well, it... Exercise and diet helps, like, your sleep, too. That's another thing, and that's something I consistently struggle with, as many of you will know. Alright. What do you think about exams? I think standardized tests are retarded, personally. I think the fact that our education systems very frequently rely on standardized testing... Uh, above other, what I would argue to be more important things is a travesty. This is like my opinion, man. Also, what's going on, Parallax? I'm doing bad with chat. Chat's actually pretty fucking lit right now. Help me through my exam. No, I'm stupid. Um, I, I'm not a very knowledgeable or wise person. I probably will not be able to help you with whatever it is, especially if it's something regarding chemistry or math of any sort. Like, maybe if it were, maybe if it were to be, like, biology or, like, anatomy and physiology or something like that, uh, like, physics to a lesser extent, then I can help you a little bit, but... That's a Patreon perk, homie! <laughs> still more, good god. Draw your live vid when? Never. Tolomeo. Oh, can you please stop, Hank? I would appreciate it, my friend. <laughs> I like how I don't even have to show my own merchandise because Papadap does it for me. But yeah, the, the, the website where I sell my, my shirt and shit and, like, the phone cases or whatever the fuck is having a sale. They're pretty much always having a sale, honestly. It's not particularly rare for them to have a sale on fucking everything. 
It's not merch. It's a permanent store. Like, the shit that's, that I put on there is not time-limited, because I think that's lame, personally. But... Give me money! Contractual shit? No, it's just, uh... Where the fuck is this last orb? God damn it! What is that noise?! Is this Bug Gachi or some shit? Like, what the fuck, dude? I'm pretty sure I have to find the source of that noise. Sif merch? Well, the, the shirt I have has Sif on it. It has the rat, too. Oh, okay. I thought this was a transition to the other area. I'm fucking stupid. What else is new? Oh, I could probably go back to the fucking essence lady now. I have 295 shits. Very good. Rather fall asleep in a snap or wake up in a snap? I already fall asleep in a snap, so I'd take that, I guess. Pick the devil that I know. Cause um I, I have I've never had issues falling asleep. Maybe once. Like a month or two ago I had one night where I was like, oh fuck, I can't sleep for shit. But that's really uncommon for me. I don't usually have that sort of issue. What the fuck is that emo? I don't like it. This area is really pretty. Your game's really pretty. I use melatonin to fall asleep and still wake up at night. That sucks. My thing... My personal sleep-related demon that I struggle with is I'm almost always drowsy during the day. Regardless of how much sleep I get, I am perpetually drowsy. Oh, it's a good thing I bought that key. Okay. Uptime about four hours. What's going on, Grant? Oh my God! There's a there's a lot happening right now. Okay, I got fucked. Subs get free shirts? Nope. Okay. That was, uh... I was not expecting that. What's good, Robo Hobo? I like your voice. Well, thanks. I don't, but I appreciate you saying that. I can't listen to myself. It's fucking impossible. Like, someone made... Actually, you know what? I won't. I won't say that. But I, I need to keep that on the on the down low, I guess. But when when there's an instance where my voice is present in something, I cannot listen to it. It's impossible. I'm just like, man, I sound like an asshole. I think everyone has that to some degree. But it's really bad for me. I, I think I have it in excess compared to normal people. So I should be, by all rights, used to it by now. Okay. So it's probably not smart coming in here and trying this again. With none of the Java juice, but... Oh, yep. Yeah. My little my little clone fucked me there. Dude, 
10 homing, holy shit. Okay, this is a fight where I think that I am never gonna have to heal. I need to go in full health and just bank on never getting an opportunity to heal. Because he, I really am not seeing too many opportunities to do that. Like he's, he doesn't seem particularly difficult, but it, I don't have much time to learn because if I get hit, I'm not getting my health back. I also should probably get the, the bench that's closer at some point. That would probably be good. <laughs> I don't have to run three years. Run from a different area. That's that's optimal. That's that's peak performance. So I'm pretty sure this isn't a boss. I don't think I saw like a name for it. It's like a normal enemy. Kinda like the uh the weird ghost we saw earlier. That fired a bunch of like homing tracking projectiles, but it wasn't like a named boss or anything. There's a closer bench right here too. There's literally a bench right before the boss fight, and I'm just being a, I'm being a Damas. Okay. So this is gonna be rough for me because I have to manage the multiple target thing. I have to hit the little stupid ghosts, or they add up. Okay, get over here. This time I won't be on the wrong foot by getting fucked by my ghost either. Oh, okay. Fuck! It's not what I meant to do, dude. I'm all right. That's GG. These fucking ghosts are like spawning on my ass. Christ Almighty, this dude's irritating. Okay. Holy fuck! This is definitely the hardest fight in the game I've faced so far, at least as far as single enemies go. But it's mostly because of the ghosts. Like, I feel like if you make an error, the ghost starts snowballing you in the fight really quickly. Right. I just don't have enough time to do everything that I'd like. Fuck! That time, I... Fuck you. No, tried to heal, shouldn't have. Damn! He fucking, like, I dashed backwards to avoid him? And he teleported to where I dashed and just fucking point blank projectiled me. That's fucking nuts, so. Holy shit. Okay. <sighs> Holy fuck. Okay, he's got a lot of health, too. I think, uh. I think this one's gonna be rough. There's just sometimes like that where. Ghosts always spawn to cover his openings. Damn, that, that hits you a little bit before it looks like it will. Fuck. What am I doing? Fuck, I'm cornered. God damn it, these stupid fucking ghosts! This guy is fucking nuts compared to everything else I fought up until this point. Nothing else even compares. I think this is the point where I need to start practicing the charge attacks. I need to be using those more actively. Like the whirlwind. Oh, could potentially really help. Okay. 
Okay. Hot. See, he seems to always be able to basically get me wherever I'm gonna go. Wow, that went, that went far that time. to heal, what are those? Holy shit, okay, fuck. That beetle's fucked up. I was getting it towards the end, but god damn. Alright. Okay. What? I, I like how this is like every other game like this where they're random fucking mini bosses that are harder than the actual bosses. What's this? Sure. Chat was deathly silent. I mean, I wasn't talking either. I was being quite rude. Is this gonna let me? So unleash a more powerful spirit. Okay, so it just improves my thing. Fuck. I thought it was gonna let me pass through the little shade things. Like the little walls of shit. Alright. I mean, I guess having a better projectile attack's cool too, but. I thought for a second that that's the, uh, that's what I was gonna need. But maybe it still is. Maybe I could shoot the shade shit and be, oh, yo, you're my homie and let me through. I doubt it, but you never know. Okay. So now we can keep going. Alright. So, we gotta go down this way. So, man, how about them Broncos? Later, Moose Milk. Right. I'm debating which way I should go here. What are the Broncos? Some sports team. I don't even know what, what fucking sport they belong to. I just know the name Broncos and it triggers some people. Okay. We're from Texas. And... Excuse me. Next season we'll pull, pull through respectable. Oh boy, more of these. What the fuck is that thing, dude? Oh, that Shade Soul hits hard. If I killed that thing that quickly, that shit does some serious damage. Go cowboys. Come on. Oh my god, that thing hurts. Jesus. I'm just gonna use that from now on. Why even melee? I like the music, by the way. What the fuck is this? So, purchasing that elegant key just for the possibility of using it at some point was a good decision. That was me being, uh, being my normal dumb self and buying shit I don't need, just in case, and having it actually pay off. A little bit laggy. I've been having those issues tonight, sorry. It's just been a fucky stream night, I suppose. No! I, I have the power of, of God and anime on my side. This time, bitch, fuck you. Ask me about my Shade Soul. Idiot. 
fucking easy. I'm so good at this game now. I got so much skill from the last encounter with that guy that I'm just a fucking god now. What can I say? 100% skill juice. Yeah, and, and it, it's the combo, dude. Talk shit, Launders. Launders, what anime do you like, dog? You don't say Boku no Pico to guy. I'm gonna fucking be pissed. Oh, what the fuck are these things? They look like me. Hunter x Hunter? I don't know what that is. Is that a, a big titty goth GF anime? Shouldn't have come back, bro. You should have let it go. Friendship cancelled? I'm sorry. I'm actually not a big anime, dude. I, I used to watch it, but I, I haven't really watched anything modern. Even the new popular shit that everyone rants and raves about, like, uh, Devil Man Cry Baby or whatever the fuck it's called. That's a stupid name, by the way. Whoever made that name should feel bad. Just saying. Okay. It's back in the 90s? Are you serious? What's good, Gaben? Ow! Holy shit, I'm, I'm, I'm being attacked by my own doppelgangers. In Japanese? If it, I don't think so. Wouldn't it be like Deburu Man Crybaby? Don't they say like Devil is Deburu? Isn't that the pronunciation or is it not the same English name in Japanese? Like, cause some animes have like the English names even in Japanese. Oh, okay, I'm a retard then, sorry. I didn't see Cowboy Bebop until 2016, though, so... one day. Ow. That was fucking rude. Dude, where the fuck? Okay. Just notice he pulls out a little mat. Yeah, yeah. The, the amount of detail is pretty dope. Let me some anime, but still to watch Cowboy Bebop. You, you can't, you can't fucking be an anime fan and not have watched Cowboy Bebop. Oh my god. I'm gonna have to hit him with the with the shindig. I need some of, more of those worthless puddle enemies to charge my my mana. I don't like the fact that the music stops out there. Is this gonna be bad? Yeah, I'm not going out there, dude. Fuck you. <laughs> How fat is your ass? I don't have a very fat ass. I'm a bony white dude. Thank you for the 100 bit super weenie. What's good, Dak? Do it now. Nah, I'll do it when I find a bench. There's a boss out there. I can, there's some areas you can just tell, you know? Right, mm, girl, I know there's gonna be some fucked up shit out there. We're in 
no rush. We will kill him when we are ready. There is no hurry. Where the fuck am I? What on God's green earth is going on? Okay, dude, what the fuck? I'm so lost right now. It's because all of the new shit I've explored isn't mapped out yet. That's a, uh, exciting feature. I'm not used to it yet. You come? Gimme, give gimme give the goodies. For everything? I didn't do shit. No problem, dude. I'm just an asshole. I'm just, a, I'm just some dick fuck on the internet playing video jams. Some people swear by X-Files. I like the X-Files a lot until the later seasons, personally. Later seasons made me fucking so sad. I haven't even watched, like, the new reboot X-Files or whatever the fuck because... ...of how bad the last uh, couple seasons in the original were. God. What the- Get the fuck away from me, you scary ghosts! I don't know what Spell Twister is, but I got it. The reboot's so fucking good, I might have to watch it. I, Amanda would be mad at me if I watched it without it, though, so maybe when she comes over this summer. Okay. Alright. I'm waiting. Oh, God. Is that Teddy from Persona 4? Okay. Oh, my God. He fakes you out. How rude. So I just wasted all my shit, no big deal. <laughs> Fuck. God damn it. Okay. This one's. This is gonna be so annoying with how far the bench is, though. This game, I've noticed, really does have a big boner for putting benches in fucking Saudi Mongolia. Yeah, and I... I explored every room of that place, too. Okay. And I just wish they weren't so stingy with the checkpoints. That's really my only... My, my only qualm with this game. Is it's, it, it seems to be the norm. Like, the Mantis lores. I'm... I, I had a sense of relief when I beat them early, despite not really doing too got, good on the attempt I killed them, just because I was so fucking far to the checkpoint. It's alright, it's fine. It's not gonna be as bad as Dark Souls. It's not gonna have, like, a, a, a lever where you can get interrupted by normal mobs if you try to run past shit, and I think we have moderate shortcuts to get over there. I guess it gives me a chance to get my, uh, my, my juice back. It's not personally, I, I'm, I'm not trying to be a whiner, it's fine. I'm not, I'm not mad about it or anything. I'm really not. But, I would prefer, personally, uh, if boss fights had a checkpoint right before them. This is personal preference of mine. Because then it, it lets me, uh, it lets me kill myself on the boss if I don't like the attempt where I'm about to win. But I don't, I don't like doing that if the run back's long. This guy's kind of... He wants my attention. Ah. Huh? Hello, Trident. So this boss seems interesting. Such a long run back, though. Holy shit. I 
There's one like that in BB? Um, kind of. I think. Oh, he's back. Later, Jezel. Have a good night, man. Is there seriously no, like, way to get back? So I have to remember what he does. He does the homing projectiles, and then he slams. But he can also fake out his slam. He, like, input reads if you jump too early, I think. Yeah, kind of like that. Hot, stop doing the ball. That appears to be a heal opening. Damn it! I have no idea how to deal with the fake out, honestly. Okay. <laughs> I like the yodels. I like the yodels. That was a nice battle cry. Rather deal with shit demon Miyogi? It's been so long, I don't even remember what Miyogi's like. Oh no, there's more. Good, Danny. All right. The second phase was just to try to get you. Okay. All right. Two, two attempts. Yeah, I'm terrible, dude. I get my. That was fucking bad. I shouldn't have died the first time. He's easy. Really, the only thing that gets you is the uh. The fucking... The fake out. That's really the only thing. The fake out. I thought that was Desolate Dave for a second. Yeah, you acquired the Desolate Dave. My favorite fucking upgrade. Tap B while holding down. Okay. Hit the boss with the dream mail. Oh boy. Oh god, what the fuck? Are you... Oh, these are just the normal summon ghosts. I can do I can use the desolate Dave here. Oh 
Oh god, get, get the hell away from me, you creepy bastards. So, what you guys are telling me is if a boss leaves a corpse, I can dream nail it, and I assume it's going to be a bigger version of the fight. I wonder if I could upgrade my nail. Extra fight when you come back to him, I see. Interesting. You can upgrade it, but you have. No, I found the blacksmith. Um, unless there's separate ones for each upgrade. Big dick upgraded bosses? Okay, let me see. What the fuck is this? Alright. That's the waves feel higher. All right. Shit. Damn. Okay. Well, this this is fascinating. Is that a wizard frog? Yep. What's good, OG? Okay. Does it spawn me back? Okay, I, I'm gonna fight him then until I win. If it, if I don't have a run back, then this is this is going to be enjoyable. Okay. I, if I, if I had to run back, it'd be like, okay. Maybe I'll come back later. But if I start at the beginning, nah, I'm, I'm I'm all in. I'm gonna have to actually learn how to fight this guy. Now I'm not sure what to do about that though. Ow, and I got hit by the return too. See that? Fake out. Damn it. Okay, I think I see what I have to do for those. Fuck! Too greedy. Fuck, you got me. All right, all right. HP buff too nice. All right. I survived a while though. I'm getting the idea, I think. All right. Asshole moves around. Yeah, he's he's jiggling. He's very he's very agile for a uh, for a Walmart elemental. Damn it. 
fake out is still pretty much gonna be what fucks me every single time, I feel. Imagine there's a way to deal more damage to him during that, uh, right there, but... Damn, the fake out is the hardest attack by far. By a country fucking mile. Damn it. to go into the corner during that. Oh shit, that creature's trying to hit him. Nope. If he does that, I'm pretty much fucked. I have no idea how, how to deal with that wave shit. I'm not sure why I stopped playing. Oh, did you not finish this game? I feel like it would... I know there's going to be a double jump ability. Based on some of the shit that I've seen uh, obstacle-wise, I know there pretty much has to be a double jump ability, so I feel like that would make that, that fake out wave shit significantly easier to deal with. As of right now, I pretty much just have to have fucking iron reflexes. Pretty much just gonna have to learn how to play well enough to where I can just I can accept that I'm going to get hit by that. Because with a little bit more practice and muscle memory, most of the other shit doesn't seem too bad. Oh really? The mist. Interesting. Oh, God. Now I'm getting fucked and dropping the skets. Disregard that, I'm retarded. enough. Okay. Hmm. I'm sorry. I'm not, I'm not doing a very good job of talking and fighting at the same time. My bad. Um, I like this fight, though. It seems like the optimal way of doing that is to hit him. Oh, I lucked out there. Alright, I think I figured out how to deal with the jump. If I dash away, I have enough time to... If he does the single jump, the dashing away gives me enough time to jump after. Oh, fuck. I'm, I'm doing a bad job of expressing my thoughts. And it, it gets me away, so if he, if he fakes me out I, and I do it right, I should be okay. I just have to stop doing shit like that. It's one of those things that I have a solid idea, but I need to put it into execution. Okay, maybe not. I'm just kidding. Nope. 
I feel like double jump is going to be uh, very helpful. Controller? I'm playing with a controller. Charge attacks? I could, yeah, that's a good point. I actually feel like getting Cyclone fucks me up. Because I'm, I know I'm going to accidentally do uh, one that I don't want. I'm not entirely sure how to land these is the problem. Pretty much the, the the singular time he decides not to uh oh god do the double huh? nope I still think that the the best chance I'm going to have is basically just going to be getting good enough at the rest of the fights where I can just tank the uh Tank the slams, but I have to get better at punishing him as the thing to keep enough heals to actually do that. Fuck. Huh? Voice clips really make me think. Yeah, I like the noises he makes. They're very sensual. Oh shit. That was a weird. Oh, no, you got me. Okay. Also, what's good, still? Love for donuts. Upgrading your nail. Yeah, I only upgraded it once so far. I feel like it's really... It's really just the, the double jump thing. Still on this boss? Yeah, I suck. Sorry. Okay. Nope. Yeah, I, I detest people telling me how to do bosses score. Nothing, nothing irritates me more than that. Huh? See, this would be trivial with double jump. It really would. Maybe not trivial, but I would be able to tank almost everything. Huh? Do your fire shit. Thank you. I fucked that up though, so I didn't get any benefit from it. God damn it, I need to stop that. There's gotta be a way to damage him better than what I'm doing right now. Okay. Come out on the switch. This would be interesting on the switch. Switch seems to be turning into an indie game machine, which is kind of cool, I guess. Also, I remember there was a game that I thought about playing a long time ago called Eider or some shit. I don't even know if that game ever came out. seems I need to learn how to consistently hit him twice there okay god again getting fucked by RNG right now holy shit okay Ider yeah yeah and then the one time he he 
doesn't. No. Can you stop? Yikes, yeah, yikes, fellow gamers. Oh my god. <laughs> Whoopsie. It's a fucked up combo of shit. Well, I mean, I don't know where it is, Danny. I'm playing this blind. <laughs> I'm 100% thought. Okay. It seems like I can get three hits in and trade there if I really want to. Yell? That wasn't a yell. You have an odd definition as to what constitutes a yell, my friend. What? Huh. Okay, usually I'm safe in the corner. I think I went there too early, maybe. Love the soundtrack of Pyre. Okay. Wait till you get to the little shit boss. I want a CWC Rage Emo. So I got him to maybe one fifth there, maybe one fourth at most. Doing this with no double jump and no nail is kind of, uh. Feel like this. I I'm sure everyone has done it this way, but I feel like, uh, not everyone. I feel like this is the unoptimal way of fighting the boss at this point. Oh, that's... Alright. Scream for help. What? It feels worth tanking a hit there. I get it. I get enough to uh to heal what I tank and do more damage. Okay. This is so rough though. If he if he spams that, it's gonna be really bad. Oh, I fucked that up. I did. Right strategy, poor execution, I suppose. Alright. Fuck, I jumped too soon, god damn it. Maybe I should try hitting him there. Just fuck it. Oh, that sucked. God damn it. Okay. Fuck. I was doing okay up until I took that hit there. Can't take stupid hits like that. Okay. Yeah, he did it twice. Alright, so it's uh 
It's basically hoping he doesn't use that too much and not getting hit by the other shit. Alright. Don't scream like that ever again. I'm not screaming. I think... Some of you would cry. If I were to actually scream. I don't think I've ever screamed on stream before. Maybe I should. Stop screaming. Oh. Damn it. Okay. This is an abortion of an attempt already. That's just pretty much going to hit me. Maybe there's some uh, uh, some way of dealing with that that I have not yet puzzled out, but as of right now, it's not. That wasn't a real scream. I mean, like an angry scream, Scoot. Probably wasn't worth what I just did there, but... Ooh, okay. What's good, Shizzy? Sorry, I'm... Why, why are you believing in me? What the fuck is wrong with you? You should know better than that. Okay, can you, can you please do your circle thing now? Oh shit, I thought he was doing something else. No, I'm fucked. Ugh. He sucks, true. Dude, fuck. The hitbox and I still want Oh, fuck you. That's fucked up. Oh my god. Okay. Alright. I always think he's gonna be doing something different, like when he, when he skirts off to the side like that. Nope. Okay. Alrighty. I need to start charging too, but I'm not I'm not comfortable enough with dodging shit to charge. So I feel like it's maybe I should charge when he's uh when he's exhausted, when he gets staggered. I staggered him twice there, I think, so there's progress, but not by much. Okay. Oh shit. First one managed to miss. Okay, I'm already fucked. <laughs> For a second, I thought you were being serious, Parallax. I was about to fucking smack you <laughs> through the internet. Oh, okay. I'm too far behind with the damage uh, curve right now. What? The bouncing because I, I hit him thing is really not doing me too many favors. Okay, I lucky there. Ah. Okay, 
game. Maybe I should have charged, like I said. Done a, a, a cheeky charge attack. Fuck. It's doing okay for a second. Yeah, he's just gonna hit me there. Huh? Wait, did I actually fucking avoid that? How? Song of encouragement? I don't like those. I don't like being encouraged. Oh no, not enough time to listen really quick. Ow, okay. And a little bit greedy. This is gonna happen. At some point, I'm gonna get fucked. Got me with the rebound. I'm doing bad now. Fuck. Spaghetti. Alright. Fuck me. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, really? Really? That's. Oh, I'm fucked now. That completely fucked me. Stop being in the air when you do that. It's fucked up. Okay. What is going on in chat right now? Oh shit, really? It was an okay attempt, but I don't, I don't think I'm going to make it through this. Alright. Nope. He's going to do it again. He's going to do it right now. He's going to double pound me. Nope. I'm just going to jump on him. Okay. 
I'm so bad at this game. Holy shit. Alright. That wasn't me getting unlucky or anything. He actually gave me really good RNG on the double pounds. Just, I need to get better at the six flame attack mainly. Okay. It's already four o'clock. Holy shit. It'll probably be like two more hours before I beat this guy to straight. I don't even think he was halfway dead. <laughs> okay. I think I liked the part where I was just tanking him and getting three hits in better. That seemed to work a lot better than what I'm trying to do by trying to actually avoid his shit. Oh shit. What an asshole! Hey, thank you for the resub, Finding Nemo. I appreciate it, dog. Thank you very much. Okay. I need to get better at, uh... Everything, really. I think I hit him with that big dick charge attack. Give me a sec. I don't think that's the real soul tie. Let me see. Thank you, Chrysler, for putting Soul Tyrant in the cuck shed. I appreciate it, dog. Thank you very much. Fuck. Too greedy for damage. Damn it. In that situation, I shouldn't have jumped early. So I'm only going to be able to dodge it if... He actually, uh, just decides to do the double for no reason. Okay, I'm gonna take this opportunity to get some heals off. Ouch, really? Fuck, I should've gotten that third hit. This is the thinking emoji boss, huh? He's always fucking hooning. Okay. That went well. I wonder... I'm, I'm really bad at hitting him during that consistently. At least multiple times. Also, shout out for the little mantis badge that gives me a... Extended range. it up. God damn it. That double slam is such a boner killer. Oh my god. Now I'm just gonna spam it until I die. Yeah, I feel entirely at the mercy of whether or not he decides to spam that shit. TBH. That actually hit me, but the hitbox didn't deal damage to me for some reason. I wonder if I can hit him out of that. Nope. 
Oh, you get so sad when I can't get the two hits there. Yeah, I should be able to get... If I get really good at that opening, I can... Oh, shit. I can hit him three times, but I'm, I'm not very good at that opening, so... Oh! Okay. That answers that question. Oh, fuck. See, I knew that was gonna happen at some point. Like, I think that getting the whirlwind thing was a mistake, honestly. Because I wanted to just do the regular slash, but because I was holding the fucking button, uh, I did the cyclone, which is kind of fucking worthless in comparison. It's, it's worthless for this fight. But it's good to know that I can knock him out of that if I do it right. Okay, I'm, I'm in a bad way right now. Uh, that went surprisingly well. It was a flurry of blows, and I came out to Victor. Unbelievably, perhaps. Heal. Smack. Oh! That's. Okay. Oh, that came out way faster this time. not going to give me healing openings, you see. Nope. I have to do that last phase without getting hit at all. Because I'm not going to get heals. Alright. I got the first phase down, but that second phase seems harder. Just because the fireballs are coming at a speed in which I need to figure out how to avoid that. Oh, that was good. That was the best attempt yet. I got thrown off because the second part of that fight happened a lot quicker than it did in the main game. Like, it took a, it took a few seconds for him to get back up and start doing shit. He, he, he was ready to fuck as soon as he fell down there, so I know for next time. Okay. And the bad thing is, since this dude has inflated HP to fucking back, that second phase is probably gonna last forever. Oh, come on. Come on! As long as I, I don't actively lose health off of that, it's fine. Damn it. I hate it when I don't get the second hit off on that really bothers my bottom. I don't know what I'm failing to do that I was doing last time that let me get uh, multiple hits on that. Uh -huh. I feel like that slash really helps damage-wise. It probably makes it... I don't know how the stagger works in this game, but if I had to warn, I guess, it makes me, uh... get closer to the... Oh, God. The next stagger, because I've already dealt damage to him. Fuck you. Alright. Things were going well, now it's just Spaghetti City. I just have to do like the shortest hop possible to actually be able to punish that properly. Wow, that didn't hit me. Fuck. It's impressive that I missed that. Just kidding. Alright, yeah, that's GG. <laughs> I'm fucked now. I'm 100% pulling juice.
right? <laughs> oh, okay. That seemed to work better. Started to heal there for no real reason. I, w I was kind of being an asshole and being cheeky to think that he'd get punished for it. Getting punished for mistakes, how horrifying. Alright. Damn it. He's so close to being knocked down again. Standing in the center seems to be safe for that. Huh? Alright, I'm definitely getting better at this part, but that second phase is gonna be rough. So I'm gonna have to figure out how to dodge all of the fireballs pretty much. Maybe not perfectly, but pretty close. I'm not I'm not gonna be able to heal, I think. It really does not look like I'm going to have an opportunity to heal during that second part. So. I should probably use my, my bug juice in that phase for damage. Hit him with some Shadow Realm Blast or some shit. That was some good fucking damage, goddamn. I want, I want to get that extra hit in, I'm being greedy. I think the next knockdown after this will be phase two. It's interesting how effective tanking hits in this game can be. Just because you get your, your heal back for dealing damage to him. It's like Bloodborne. You spam R1 and get all your health back. So this isn't the Dark Souls of platformers at all, this is the Bloodborne of platformers. Huh? What a dick. Okay. Oh, I missed, fuck. I overestimated the range, alright. Now for the next part. What? in magic during that since I'm not going to be getting heals. Dude, that first one has so much tracking on it, it's crazy. me this this part's so hard because you get no fucking uh opportunity to heal he has so much health i think i was maybe halfway through that second phase there um but probably not he probably had a lot more to go i need to get better at actually using the magic in combat i never use it it's never been necessary i just i need to also be aware that the very first slam he does seems to have a lot more tracking than the remainder of them like, the only time I've ever been hit by the slams during that now is the, when it's the very first one. Okay, getting greedy. It's okay. I think I'm 
alright enough at this phase to be a little bit rambunctious. Uh, unless he spams this again. That, that is the thing, like, if I have no bug juice, I am kind of at the mercy of him not, not spamming the slams, because I've still found no reliable way to deal with that. But usually it doesn't happen enough to outpace my healing. This is such a long fight, goddamn. I could have healed there, I should have healed there. Super spaghetti drop, that's okay. We're fine. Unless, nope, nope. He knows. He smells blood in the water. He's gonna he's gonna spam the fucking uh double pound on me. Okay, I'm 100 percent full this time though, for real. I don't I don't think there's much getting out of this one. This is This is the infamous one-way ticket to Pound Town. really lucky that I interrupted him out of the slam. Ooh, I got four hits. What a fucking badass. Okay. Pretty much I'm back at the... Back at square one on this one. That's not at all what I wanted to do. Fuck. Just being a... A big tard right now. I'm still gonna be shooting stuff. Come. Come. I wonder how much extra damage the charge slashes do. Come. Getting fairly consistent at this phase, ball. Until that happens. This is really the only X Factor. Is the the fake out. Oh, I ran right into that like an asshole. No, no heal. I guess it didn't feel like pressing the button. <laughs> I guess I pressed it too early on after I had taken damage earlier or something. Damn, what a barrage, holy shit. I don't think I've seen him go that hard with those. What the fuck? Alright, I'm calling shenanigans on that one. I was fucked up and you know it. Okay. Back to spamming this, huh? Thankfully, now that I don't really get hit by the, the fireballs too often... It's pretty hard for him to deal enough damage to kill me with all this healing that I have. Oh, I could have avoided that one. I just assumed. I pretty much just always assume that he's gonna do the double now. We know. We know what happens when you assume. Because you're a stupid piece of shit and he's died. How dare you assume anything about me? I don't know what I- that was a deer in the headlights thing. I'm getting so used to him just chaining the fireballs for three fucking years. That I forget he could do other shit, I guess. Huh? Damn, that went by fast that time. At least it felt like it did. I only 
have a small amount of blood hurting juice. I just, I let that hit me. Dude, fuck, I can't even see where they're all coming from now. I wish I could hit him during this. What? Huh? Fuck, god damn it. I got cut off, I got pincered between two of them. That fireball phase is so bad. I'm so shit at it. I told you, that you strap in because it's going to be two hours for this shit. Because uh, healing is too slow for that second phase. I can, I can try to heal, and maybe his fireballs will just miss. That's possible, but that, in all likelihood, I'm just going to get fucked. It's going to take the hit. Now my big thing is that I need to deal as much damage as possible. I need to get this dude's ass banned. That was the first hit I took. Okay. Actually works, huh? Right. I'm at half of my blood hurting juice. Damn, it was worth a shot. Oh shit. I'm getting too aggressive. I didn't expect him to do that. Got him with that shit. I still don't really know how important it is to get the charge attack off there. For all I know, it's doing absolutely nothing. I figure why not at least try. Alright, get my shit back. I might get some Shadow Blast in if I really want. Not like that at all. That was pretty bad. He's not very good at the magical attack at all. Kind of sat there for a second and thought about it. Okay. He's standing on me now. I even got the hit in too. I still feel like double jump would make this shit so much easier. Although I don't think it would really help me for the second phase. I think the second phase is just an execution problem on my end. I need to I need to stop getting so carried away and be a little bit more patient. Like I, I try to take on safe openings, which is stupid considering how that phase works. This part is basically just muscle memory now. Really? Suck my dick. I got so lucky there, holy shit. I don't- I don't- I don't know why he just decided to go for the regular one there, but I'll take it.
being too greedy. It's worth it, though. The damage is the most important thing at this point. Right, these are the fireballs. Getting that extra damage in, baby. Don't give a fuck. <laughs> I got lucky again. This is me. This is Tolomeo getting lucky, the musical. Oh, shit. Huh? I need to save up my, my bone hurting juice. Cause that, that shadow blast hits really hard. I, I need to hit those during that last phase. It's going to add up really quickly. Ouch. Alright. Okay. I told you, that first one sometimes just has crazy tracking. I don't think it's me just imagining it, honestly. Maybe I'm just being a baddie, but... That just happens far too frequently at this point. Okay, fuck it, finally. Christ. How embarrassing. Okay. I don't want to listen. Fuck you. Maybe I should upgrade my weapon now. That's a fun fight. I still get a little bit, a little bit miffed by the, uh, the, the double slam shit. But, I don't know. I, I, oh yeah, I have the Dave slam now. That's right. What is it called? It's the Dave slam, right? Sad that it didn't take four hours. That's, that took a long fucking time, though. I feel like that... It probably shouldn't have taken as long as it did, but well. Oh God, why? What? Why is he in jail with that anime waifu? That's fucked up. What did he do? Like, I understand the anime waifu being in jail, but what did that poor man do? That's fucked. I don't even know what to say about that. Threw up and laid on my bathroom floor. Yeah, that's what I would have done too if I saw me play this game. It was fun though. I liked it for the most part. I feel like I got lucky in the second phase though. That time. Like, I didn't really have to actively dodge the fireballs. Like, it seems like sometimes... He'd put them up, and they'd, like, triangulate, and it was fucking retarded, and it would be, like, uh, ridiculous to dodge all the shit. You know what I mean? But not that time. That time it felt like they were all, uh, they were far enough away from each other that it wasn't really too hard to avoid them. I don't know if that was actually the case, but that's what it felt like. So these just respawn infinitely? It looks like it, huh? Alright, 
we did it. I don't like all these bugs. These corpses. Look at them. They look so they look so innocent. The game's turning me into a bug sympathizer. What's going on, baby? Isn't it a little bit early for you to be up? Alright. Sorry that took so long, but hopefully, uh. Hopefully you didn't actually have to vomit. <laughs> if you have a ton of weed frames, you tolerate their shit, you will eventually want to watch it yourself. So have you watched Boku no Pico to Guile though? Cause I heard that was the best anime. And it's two bars and they're very spaced. I mean, yeah, this is, it, it's it's a two D game though. the fuck do I press again? Anime makes you gay. That's what I was trying to say. Oh, okay. Okay. I understand now. I think I get it. Wait. There's more shit over there in the Soul Sanctum than I... Wait, no. There might not be. Because it, the map doesn't fucking update for some, for some nebulous reason. Alright. So, Parallax, are you here? I actually have a question. Or, or Aerolof. Either one of you, if you know. How much damage does the little dark cummies blast do compared to the sword? Like, if, like numerical value wise. Okay. Ow. Ow. These things are fucking worse than Soul Turn. I hate these son of bitches. Fucking dumb. Damn it. I watched it when I was 13, but I, I, I quit it the second episode because the bitch got fucked by a crocodile, dude. Yeah, like, I I watched the entire thing, but like, oh shit, hot anime maids. I want to watch this. That's hot. So it's fucking, like, 13. And then, once they started getting fucked by the alligator, I'm like, okay, that's enough for me. It was back before I was, like, this jaded piece of shit who watches horrific things on the internet, like, uh, like, rural balls streaming. Now I'm just a degenerate. I need to go to bed soon so I can wake up for those fish. A vote for me is a bullet for a weed. Oh. Just 30? Okay, so it's, it's pretty much three hits. One thing I actually abused a little bit is one of the... I played a lot of Valda's story. I don't know if you played that Parallax, but one of the things that I would have used in that game is if you swung midair, I should probably heal. You'd like hang for a bit. That doesn't happen in this game, but I noticed you hang for just just, just a smidgen if you use the dark cummy blast. So I was using that a little bit to dodge the fireballs um, during that last fight. It's very useful. Maybe if I, I timed it right, I could have used it to avoid the double wave from... Oh, this is not good. The double wave from the first phase. This game's kind of exhausting. Like, I like it a lot and I have a lot of fun, but like all this like, exploration shit and remembering all the different places where I could have used the, uh, the Dave Stomp is mind-boggling at times. Okay. So, yeah, yeah, you did that in Valda Story, too. To, you use, like, little magical spells to, like, extend how long you stay in the air and you can get to places early by doing that. Missed that fucking game. This game's probably better, but... I still like Valda Story a lot. Even if that was the final boss and the game ended right here, it was at least like 50 times better than Salt and Sanctuary, I gotta say. I'm just gonna take every opportunity I, I can possibly get to shit on Salt and Sanctuary. So. How many. Actually, no, not, I'm not gonna ask. I'm not gonna ask that question. See, I have all these questions that are floating around in my mind, but I don't wanna ask because I don't. I fear people will give me too much info and, like, spoil shit. Okay. Those shit god bosses. Oh, dog. Those were fun, though. 
I like those bosses because they're like the only ones that didn't have fucking ads. That's like the one thing about Valda's story that I hate is like so many bosses just have ads. Um, the god bosses did, despite being frustrating at times. And the the ice one was pathetically easy. The fire one was pretty hard, but the ice god in Valdis was was easy peasy. Stone Sanctuary. I just have a personal vendetta. A lot of people like it. It seems to be like a, a, a an average game for a lot of people. But for me, I have a disdain. Okay. It's amazing. Beat is real. I beat all with all the characters. I think that uh. I think that the little demon arm dude was the most overpowered shit in that game, personally. I think his name is Vlad? Alright, dude, take it easy. I agree, SCP. A good example would be the Mantis uh, fight in this game. Like, the Mantis was a really good multi-enemy fight. More often than not, I feel like putting multiple enemies in a boss fight, though, is just a cheap way of making it hard. I like difficulty, but I like difficulty like the boss we just fought, where it doesn't come from, like, stupid fucking ads or whatever the hell. It's just you learning the boss's pattern. You know? Whereas ads just... Especially if it's just, like, normal enemies from the rest of the game, rather than a, uh, a mob specifically tailored for the fight, just comes off as extremely lazy. Like, Ornstein Smoke... Uh, Airy, Andal, and Freed, I consider those good multi-enemy fights. Something like Shadows of Yarnum is... I don't know. Celestial Emissary? I don't know. Living Failures? See, Living Failures is their own fight and it's unique, but it's fucking annoying still. Annoying as fuck for no- Dude, I know. I did that shit without Tearstone Ring, homie. Need I remind you? SL1, fucking no rolling, blocking, parrying, no Tearstone. I still would argue that Throne Defender and Watcher are worse, though, personally. That probably is not a popular opinion, but... I, especially if, if you were to use Red Tearstone Ring on ONS... I honestly feel like it would be too easy. That's why I didn't use it until the DLC boss. It just gives you too much fucking damage in Dark Souls 1. But your, da like your damage in the DLC goes from, like... It, 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 it's, it's just dog shit. Super Ornstein, which is significantly more difficult than uh, Super Small. Like, Smo is fucking easy. I, I, I would personally argue, because I tried both there a lot. Uh, and I, I came to the conclusion that, at least for me personally, I think that um, Smo is the much easier second phase. So the reason I did it that way was because I wanted the second part of the fight to actually be worth a shit. Like, just Super Smo seemed really lame to me because it's just, it's just electrified Smo, whereas Super Orange gets a whole new moveset and shit. That sounds super hard. Well, see, the thing is, you probably know by now. But, I found, like, an AI exploit for that fight where you can just burst down Watcher and you can just prevent Defender from rezzing the Watcher if you do it right. But up until that point, it was fucking crazy. Oh, am I going to fight you again? Yeah. Nope. Not yet. I, I'm, I'm pretty sure I will at some point, but not right now. No, absolutely, SCP. And honestly, both of the super forms are easier than Phase 1. Like, Super Ornstein's not that hard either if you're rolling and shit. Even No Roll, he's not that bad. I think I beat that fight, No Roll, the first time I got to Super Ornstein. Uh, but I, I, to be fair, I had practiced the No Roll strat for it prior to... Uh, Prior to doing real attempts. Okay, 
So what the fuck is all this? See, I always feel so overwhelmed in this game. I like it. I like that feeling. Watcher's already pretty tough. Watcher's a pain in the ass, for sure. Um... I kind of want to go and backtrack, but I also want to see the new area. See, this is, this is the dilemma, right? Is I want to see what's new and popping, but I also don't... Oh, God. This enemy has convinced me to go backtrack. I do not like the way that thing looked at me. We are we are getting the fuck out of here. This is this is a land of degeneracy, I can already tell. Mm -mm -mm. The best boss in DS1, I would definitely disagree, especially if you count the DLC. I think every DLC boss is better than Ornstein and Small. Few people were asking. Right, right. Sometimes, like during that fight, I had chat closed because uh, I was trying to. I, I was trying to focus and beat it quicker instead of getting sidelined by chat. Um, salt and sanctuary, God. Okay, where do I even fucking begin? All right. So the first thing you need to understand is that a significant portion of my critique towards this game has. I have gameplay critiques, but a lot of it has to do with the dev team and their marketing strategy. Um, so, Salt and Sanctuary, right? Mechanically, I don't like the game much because I find it to be too derivative of other games. I feel like it didn't do enough on its own. It's got the, uh, it's like epic fucking dodge base souls combat with the Final Fantasy X leveling system except shit and not fleshed out. Um, so I found it to be shallow mechanically. It was really boring in the early game because there's like a, uh, a lot of the bosses have like the same fucking jump attack. Like this jump forward in the exact same fashion. It's like, it got to the point where it was a meme where is this boss going to have the same fucking jump attack like four others do? And the rolling mechanic I feel was like clunky in general. Hello Lee on Life, what's up dog? Uh... But the more important thing for me is, it, like, an uninspired game is whatever. Like, they, I played a lot of those. It's not that big of a deal. Like, the gameplay still is not the primary critique. The primary critique I have of that game was their marketing strategy. What game are we talking about? Salt and Sanctuary. So, if you don't know, um, Salt and Sanctuary, to sum it up in brief terms, their marketing strategy was no matter what happens, no matter how developed the game is, we're gonna release it right before Dark Souls 3 to capitalize on the Dark Souls 3 hype train. And the dev said as much in some dumb fuck interview where they said that the game could have been more polished, yada yada yada. But they released it early to capitalize on the Dark Souls 3 hype. Um, and so, the problem with that is I find it difficult to respect game devs who do shit like that. Like, okay, we could make the game really good, but we'll release it early uh, just to make more money, basically. And, you know, sometimes you gotta do that as a business. I, I, I understand. I, I respect that as a business decision. But the thing is, they also were, like, paying people. Uh, like, I, I guess I, I can't say for sure if they were paid. But a, a lot of people uh, from the Souls community were... We're friends with the developers. The developers would be in their chat and they'd be doing streams of Salt Sanctuary and suck in the game's deck. Um, which rubbed me the wrong way. And so basically it felt it felt like they spent too much of their time pandering to people who like Souls in anticipation of Dark Souls 3 rather than making their game as good as it possibly could have been. And I really do not respect that when you have shit like this game and Valda's story where... They're their own games. They they have similarities to other games, but they're their own unique shit. Uh, and the devs release like free content updates for the game uh, to make the game as best as it can be. So when you compare like this that strategy of Salt and Sanctuary to shit like Hollow Knight and Valda's story, in my mind, there's no comparison to be made. Uh, I know who I'd rather support. So that's, that's pretty much my, my deal with that game. A, a lot of people disagree. Uh, they'll say, you know, well, you, 
you gotta do what you gotta do for business. Like I said, I have, I understand that to a certain degree. I respect that as a business decision, but I don't respect that as, from like the creative process uh, side of things. Am I supposed to be my exam? Yeah, I'm boring as fuck, Dojin. If you want to fall asleep, this is this is where you gotta come. Just don't actually come, though. Exactly, Paralyze. This game's a labor of love. You can tell. Like, it, 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 it's part of, part of it is it's just frustrating to me to see shit like Salt and Sanctuary get so much of an undeserved boost from just like riding on the coattails of Dark Souls. When you have shit like this and Valdis Story, which I, this game isn't unknown at this point, but th this game didn't reach all of its Kickstarter goals from what I understand. I was reading on it a little bit, and it, they built this with a relatively uh, modest budget, and it's, it's fucking amazing so far. I'm gonna lurk while I eat dinner, enjoy. Thank you for the prime sub, Doge, and I appreciate it. And thank you for using it on me, dog. And enjoy the emos. Cuphead. Well, Cuphead's good in its own right, too. Uh, Cuphead got a boost, but not because the the developers were sitting there trying, trying to wash hands with streamers and whatever. Uh, they got a big boost because the dumb fuck game journalist who <laughs> decided to be like a complete... Uh, a complete degenerate and just not understand how to beat the tutorial. That game journalist is pretty much... I, I would wager that that media explosion pretty much doubled the sales of Cuphead. Play Cuphead? No, I'll probably play it at some point. I've seen a little bit and I like the art style a lot, though. Instant noodles? Nice. Now the story should be way more popular. It's just, the game had no advertising team, basically. That's the thing. Um, it's a really good game, and they did a lot of free updates for it, and I, I think it's really good. But, it's just, you need an advertisement team to some extent, you know? Play Undertale? I actually did a playthrough of Undertale. The people who watched Undertale streams. The Undertale community got very upset with me. Want to release a new Valdis story? Yeah, Valdis story came out fucking forever ago, too. Like, it's been four or five years, I think. It's been a long-ass time. So, I think that they, if they were to make a Valdis story, too, they would knock it out of the park. I think they learned a lot from that game. It, it, it showed with the uh, increase in quality from the free updates. Am I high? Yeah, I, I'm fucking tripping, dude. Did not giggle at the skeletons and that upset them? I, would, I was just like mocking the game and like how ridiculous the dating section is. And like the first uh, goat lady, like the friendly goat lady who takes you in as an orphan, uh, I chose to fight her. And then we made up like halfway through the fight. I'm like, oh, okay, let's uh, we'll kiss and make up. And then she's like, oh, I love you. And then I fucking killed her. I, I slaughtered her in cold blood. And she's like, why would you do this? And I think that upset quite a few people, honestly. Apparently, people do not like it when you make, uh, fucked up choices in that game. It's pretty funny. Alright. Later, Parallax. Take it easy. It's a game? Well, okay. Here's the thing, Harry. Um, so... Trigger warning, I suppose. This does not necessarily apply to everyone who likes Undertale. That being said, like, the slapstick, random access humor, and the art style, the, just the general feel and design of that game attracted a, uh, a lot of people who were younger. More, more youthful exuberance than a lot of other communities would have, right? It's like, there's no, you don't, it's like the easiest fucking game in the world. You don't even know how to, you don't even have to know how to play video games to beat it. It's appealing to people who just want like a, like a feel good sort of game. Although I will, I will concede that there are elements in that game that are fucked up. Like the secret laboratory and shit. 
Um, but for the most part, it's like a win with the power, friendship, yada, 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 blah, 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 blah. And it just, it, it appeals to a younger audience. And when you have like a, a group of people who have that youthful exuberance who are younger, um, creating a community around that sort of game, and they do not, like, it, it, it's really, I feel like a lot of them are not at the point in their lives where they've had to deal with too much adversity when it comes to differing opinions. How the fuck do I do the... I There we go. What the fuck? Genocide? I fucked the genocide run up. I was actually thinking of doing it, but... Shit happened. Okay, I'm, I'm gonna have to go back for that one. There's shit up there, but I missed it. Oh, big wall. I'm all the way back here. Okay, so I pretty much just gotta go all the way back up again. Genocide run. This is honestly, like... I'll give credit to Undertale. It was not my favorite thing in the world, but I actually like the combat and the music for the most part. Like, the combat was novel. It's a decent idea. It's just, the, the humor didn't resonate with me is the main thing. Like, it's really hard to enjoy a game that tries to be humorous to that extent when the, the humor, the style of humor just does not resonate with you, right? Like, I... It, it, it's kind of like Chomp Comp said, like, I didn't laugh at the silly skeleton jokes, and it's... It's just... It's, it's not my style of humor at all. Crystal area? I beat a, a boss in the crystal area. The... The little laser dude, right? Is there another one? Wrong with genocide? Well, nothing, but some people in the Undertale community get mad if you kill their... The characters. Yeah, I beat him way earlier in the stream. So far today, I beat the very first uh, Dream Guardian, Gorg. Um, both forms of the Soul Tyrant and the Laser Dude, I think. What the fuck am I doing? I'm so zoned out. What the fuck is this? Jesus Christ, someone get Kells out of here. Rancid egg, yup. Yup, yup. Makes sense. That's not what I wanted at all. I've gotten so many upgrades today that I've I it's just been like bam, 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 one after the other, and I have none of them committed to muscle memory at this point in time. If you're moving to Frisco, Frisco's alright. I haven't been there too much, but anywhere around the DFW area isn't too bad unless you're living in like fucking Oak Cliff or something. Oh, yeah, Kells took a break for a while, Jail, but she's made a triumphant resurgence. She's, she's very frequently found worrying about Russ Jr.'s long streaming hours. Quama egg. Nice. Um, okay. Huskhorn head. Ooh, a tick tick. A gruz mother. It used to be just a gamer. Now it's, it's probably simmered down, but like I said, there were a lot of underage people who were very very passionate about the game when it first came out and they they would definitely get upset if you played it in a way they deemed unacceptable so you could like date characters and shit right and so if you killed like a like a fan favorite character that everyone loved to date or whatever this shit some people would get bottom bothered undertale yeah yeah what's going on ryan Ew. Yes. Oh, come the fuck, door. 
Okay, okay, okay. I shouldn't be wait me. I really need to go to bed so I can get those fucking fish and the shrimp. I hope they're gonna be okay. What the hell is this? I found the Dragon Balls! Okay. Hmm. Just thinking about life, don't mind me. Romantic comedy manga. Uh oh. Well, that's gonna be a yikes for me, dog. Holy shit, this place is gnarly. Ancestral mound. So what is this like? Like jilf porn? Is this what it's like? Judge me, Tolo, it's my fetish. I like those spikes. Oh. I thought they were there to hit you, but no, they're just here to lock you into a fight with these assholes. These little plague doctor fucks. Damn it. Okay. Jill of Porn, yeah, Ancestral Mount, get it? Haha, ha, so funny joke. Okay. Getting my ass walloped, holy shit. Let's spread weeb upon the normies. That's fucked up. I'm pretty sure that violates the Geneva Convention, as a matter of fact. Those fucking spikes! A playlist? No, I don't play music on my streams. The playlist will be my voice. Ew! He's sucking on a... on a something. My fetish is being given money. Oh, same. Every time I get money, I pop a huge fucking tent. I'm just like, uh? Oh? Yeah? Mm? That's what goes on in my mind, at least. Picked up his glowing womb. Yup. Indeed, we did. Fellow was dead? No, he was sucking. Two rewrites? Awesome. I just like God of War. God of War was pretty good. I'm not a big fan of the story bosses of the end game, though. Pretty much the optional bosses save that game. I don't want to say what they are because last time I spoiled Pongre and I still feel bad about it. Hey, right, thanks for the bits, Dojin. Uh huh? Only a little one. I'm only a little. It's, it's like enough to get a nipple stiff. You know? Okay. Something under Green Path. Let's see if we can get our asses over there. I'm not necessarily going for 100%, but I want to find all of the bosses. So I will I will request if you if you were particularly keen on backseating, if there's a way to like miss a boss or some shit, uh, you can tell me that. Just don't, don't give me, like, spoilery shit. But if I can miss bosses, let, let me know. That, that does suck. Gundam stream? Oh, well, you can always watch it off. Ah, it's gonna be hard to, to keep up with chat because it, I'm gonna be building something, but I'll do my best. And thanks for 10 bits, a purple dino. An SCP. <laughs> Super soldier? True, but they should have added... Like, the final boss could have been a lot harder than it was. Like, let's be real. I ever saved deck in the nest? No, I haven't gone back to that nest in a while. Final boss? Oh. 
And thanks for the bit, Stojan. I'll save Zo. Oh, yeah, so, okay then. Alright. I didn't save him, but he reappeared in the town. Did I fuck myself? Are they corpses? You know who left a corpse? I know who left a corpse. The very first boss of the game. I know for a fact that boy left a corpse. I like the dream bosses because you actually get to, s to skip the run back. That's dope. As long as you don't find his next place, he can be saved. Okay. Well, what are, what's the likelihood of uh, not finding or not or finding that place beforehand? Yeah, his mace was a beetle. It was dope as fuck. It's a really neat detail, TBH. Okay, let's save anyway. Just to be safe. Wonder how this fight's gonna be. Cuck Nami. You didn't just call people cuckolds, Pop Jack. That's fucked up. Isn't around main routes and gotcha. Can I use the nail on him? Oh, okay, never mind then. There's no I remember his corpse was there because I don't know. Maybe it's because his little grub thing is gone. Maybe it's like upstairs or some shit, I don't know. Cause he was a grub in a suit of armor. I hear a fucked up noise. What's good, cry brawl? Tired as hell? I mean, kinda. Fucking hungry, that's the thing. I've just been boring today, I'm sorry. Today definitely wasn't as good as yesterday's stream. Hopefully the Gundam stream will be doped off. Maybe there's like a wall or something I gotta break. Yeah, right here. What the fuck? <laughs> there might be a tin out. Oh, uh, uh. <laughs> I like those dudes. All right. Okay, so it does look like this is a fight. We found Cry. Yep. Found uh. Found Cry and his doppelgangers. Oh, oh my god! He's like, nah, fuck you, bitch! Okay. He's, uh, he's a little bit harder than, uh, than the first boss. I think he also took two of my health off. Okay. Is this one supposed to be like really hard or some shit? Oh man. Yeah. 
Yeah, this is... Mm -mm. This guy's supposed to fuck you, okay. That was luck, AMA. Alright, this dude is big dick. So I should probably not be doing it with, like, the, the base baby dick nail, right? That's what you're telling me? Ouch. Yeah, I, I, I don't think healing's gonna happen here. Ooh. I might have to come back later for this guy. I don't want to subject you to two things like this in a night. He's, uh... He seems pretty cool. Cool. Wonder what the successful champion's like? God. Shit, he did it twice. Attack so nice, he got he had to do it twice. Dick me down, daddy. Fuck. Oh, ho, ho. all right. Is fight so claustrophobic, yeah. Seems fun though, but I haven't even gotten him to break once. I feel like damage is supposed to be a little bit higher for this one. Calm. Falling rocks? Falling rocks don't seem like that big a deal, actually. Holy shit, that range. Calm. Ooh. 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 Okay. Give it one more try and see how it goes. I think this might be a, uh, <laughs> a little bit out of my league right now. I'm guessing I should just never fucking up. <laughs> never ever punish the waves. That seems like the easiest way to die. Notice something. Where the fuck is my spirit? Do I not get spirit for this one? I'm fucking confused actually. Oh, I think it's you only get the spirit once you once you hit his little white head, right? The little mana shits. Dream nail those small cries. Possible now with turbo speed to get a decent chance. Mm, he seems avoidable. I just have to get better at his attacks. I don't know. It seems fun trying to beat him like this. 
is going to take a while to get enough practice because you don't have much room for error since he kills you in three hits. Okay, we go. It's just hard because he's not that telegraphed. Fuck. Okay. Is this on the Switch? I don't think so. I'm playing on PC. Dash and good response times. Well, I'm fucking about to fall asleep, so the good response times. Probably not gonna happen. Alright. I need to figure out the conditions for when he does each attack. See that right there? That's the thing. Damn it. Holy fuck. Okay, hello, Glidden. Ooh. Ooh. Wait, this actually give me... Cummy. It gives me Cummy's juice, huh? Alright. Hollow Knight's on the Switch, indeed. No worries on that one. I want to know if there were missable bosses. Yeah, yeah. That's the only thing I really care about. I don't want to miss shit. Huh? Fuck. Those rocks are annoying. Always roll under. That's the thing. Is this one of those things where I my reaction times are dog shit? I'm gonna come back to this dude later. Um, oh shit, I accidentally killed him. I didn't want to do that. That's sad. Alright, so what I was trying to say is that my main thing right now is basically uh can't react fast enough for what he's doing. Cheap, everything just hits hard. Other than that, the game's boring as fuck. Tell you right, my cock is big enough to say I was wrong. Doesn't even hit hard as fuck. Like, the game's easy as shit. It's just... Not very good. Let me see if I missed anything up here. Toxic white man Tolo kills innocent marshmallow. True. My toxic masculinity came out there, I'm sorry. It's terrible and unbalanced as fuck. Literally the only boss that's capable of killing people who are on... Uh, who are paying attention is the Witch of the Lake. And even then, once you figure out the trick to it, it's not too bad. Although, the Tree of Man boss in Solid Sanctuary was designed by someone who's wrong in the head. That shit was fucked up. Whoever made that boss, you should feel ashamed of yourself. Fight is fucking terrible. God damn, it pisses me off just thinking about it, honestly. It's probably not good, huh? Okay. So let's see. This is gonna be more platforming. This is, this is my favorite thing. I'm really good at platforming. You'll see. What the fuck? One thing that... I think this game needs more of, personally, is just completely random and unexpected boss fight. Yeah, kind of like that. Oh, I was I was expecting that one a little bit. Huh? Fuck. Oh, he can melee. 
it to get tricks. Oh, I thought he was gonna jump there. Fuck. Ooh, alright. Alright. This guy likes just jizzing. I got to Tree of Man and decided I was done with the game. Yeah, Tree of Man, or Tree of Man, or whatever the fuck, was, uh. That boss was dog shit. Fight is just terrible. Although, I gotta give them props that they managed to make a boss fight that's so consistently bad that it gets that many people to stop playing the game. That takes talent, honestly. I'm not even memeing. It, it's, uh... It's kind of a dream of mine one day that I would get to make my own game. And the first boss, I would want to make it, like, 90% of players quit the game with. Oh, okay. I think that'd be sick. So I gotta go through this epic platforming section every time I want to fight this boss, huh? Huh? Final boss staggers like Gwyn. Yeah, the final boss was... I actually think he looked cool, but the fight was too easy. Tries making his own game. He wants to. Time will tell if he manages to actually go through with it. Thank God for this thing. At least get to full health before I fight this guy. What kind of game? My game or Cry's? Cry's is a fishing game. Mine would be... Oh. Yeah, I should have seen that one coming. Mine would be like a... Third person action RPG. That would be epic hard. Oh no, not this way. Alright, so let's try this boss again. He seems kind of... Fuck. I'm not even going to be full health by the time I get to him. I really just don't like you getting the bosses prepared. Huh? Give me that, my shekels. Basically, I gotta get my ass over there before he does his big ejaculate attack. But... Oh my god. Fuck you! Okay, what a fucking weird fight. Alright, is the beast Cenotar? Yeah, kinda. Cenotar, that ate too many, uh, Blongongos or whatever the shit. The arena? Literally, like, the only thing that's irritating about that boss is, like, the big cum shot. Not even really that irritating. I just need to be faster with it. The big cum shot. I didn't pay too much attention to the spread of it. I feel like I could have probably avoided it pretty easily. Alright, I think this is going to be it for tonight. I need to get to a safe spot. Um, made okay progress, I suppose. This jumping was the worst for me. I didn't mind the jumping so much. I didn't even see what that boss was called. It was like Malik the Stalker or some shit. 
It's not even paying attention. I'm, I'm, I'm out of it. I am, I am just drained. I'm like half asleep. I'm sorry. All right. So that's gonna be it for tonight. Uh, tomorrow will be Gundams. Hopefully, it'll be worth a fuck. We'll see. Uh, thanks for watching. Have a good day. Good night. Whatever the fuck it is for you. Don't chop the spaghetti. Make sure you use only three sheets of toilet paper. Don't eat vegetables. They fucking suck. Spinach is dog shit. It's terrible. And you should consider never eating it. Alright. Take it easy, dudes.